Welcome to Summit Awesome Games. Good looking people. And ugly people. I mean, I don't know what you look like. But professional, we're doing this. We're gonna make it a breeze. We're gonna save a few times. Skip cutscenes. This is all about getting an S plus rank. Saving time, saving saves. We're gonna get in five and a half hours, which is gonna be easy, trust me. Like, we're gonna muck around and we're gonna be like the cakewalk. What we're doing though, is we're gonna use the Chicago Sweeper, the chicken hat, Ashley armor, hand cannon, and DLC tickets. I don't know, that's controversial, DLC tickets. If you wanna use them, I do have a guide where we don't use them, and we don't use the hand cannon, because the hand cannon wasn't, we were working our way to a hand cannon, and the mercenaries mode dropped, and it's so easy to get the hand cannon in that. Literally just get S on all the maps or something, and you'll get it, you just play it, you'll get it, trust me. So we're using the hand cannon and Chicago typewriter. So the exclusive tickets will give us the ability to make them infinite at chapter two. So we still have to get through the village and stuff, but I'm gonna make it so easy. Don't worry, you're gonna laugh. You're gonna be like, oh my God, did they really just beat the village and professional with these weapons and not die? My God. So this will be filled with tips like this one. Run to the stairs. Run backwards. He does a double grab. And then run past him. Once he does that second grab, he can't get you. Unless you linger. Like, just run past him. This guy, we want a herb, so we're going to let him run past. Or stroll casually past, mindlessly. We're going to run over, grab this herb. If you run that entire distance without slowing down, you might throw an axe in your back. And that's not a good start. That's a crap start. So we're using the chicken hat. It reduces our damage. So we should have a lot of healing by the end. We're gonna save very often, so we should have a heap of saves. And with our infinite weapons, we have so much time left that you'll be laughing. You'll be like, oh my god, it was worth buying those three DLC tickets. And as I said, if you don't wanna buy those tickets, it's fine, we got a guide where we don't use them at all. And we don't use the hand cannon. We just use the Chicago typewriter. And we have one for unlocking that. So if you're on a new game plus, you can get it easy. So we'll take everything but that one, because that one is, you know, I don't want you to buy an extra gun. In fact, I don't recommend buying tickets at all. We're just having fun here. We're just having a good time. I'm gonna grab some more handgun ammo, because we're gonna need it in the village. Ta-da. Little tip so you don't get stabbed by this man. Stay close to him. So skim the side here and run as close as you can to him. If you run too far to the left to try and give him distance, He'll charge you and stab you. Avoid the bear trap. Run past this guy. Don't run too close to the house because he'll chop you. You don't want to get chopped. And then we're going into the village. Don't freak out. Don't worry. You're gonna be okay. We're gonna go grab a few things. We want more handgun ammo if we can, but we mainly want a grenade. A happy little grenade. Good night, lady. Have a good sleep. Grab a little bit of this. Now, if we go in this house, this triggers it. Someone sees us, I don't know who, but who cares? We're gonna go jogging. We're gonna go to the bell tower. I think it's a bell tower or a lookout. I'm gonna call it bell tower. A bellless bell tower. That's our overall objective. That's where we're gonna fight them. So for now, we're just gonna run through, grab herbs, grab a grenade that is in the house. We're not gonna go in the shotgun house just yet. Just doing a little loop, see what we can find. We might get lucky. Resource is not what I want, man. Not what I want. Some money? I don't want money. I know what I want. All right, we're gonna go up the back there. So we're gonna go through the little barn area. We're gonna grab a red herb. And this box may tempt you. Get it, don't get it. I don't mind. I'm gonna go for it. It's risky. Cause you might get grabbed like that, man. Back off. He's a stabby stabby. He'll live. He'll be fine. We grab the red herb so he can have a full health heal. And now it's business time. We're gonna jump through a window, grab a grenade, and then make our way to the bell tower. We're all set, baby. This is gonna be so easy. You're gonna be laughing. If you want, you can run and get that grenade only. And then do this. You don't have to do the little lap I just did. 
You can grab the red herb, grab the grenade after stabbing that first lady, and you'll be fine. So, with this, don't grab the green herb up here, or else the floor will collapse and you will end up on the ground. Just stand about here. I'm gonna use this. Just a little burst. It'll fire two bullets at a time. Let's go for the face, and they'll drop down. Pop. Easy. We're just gonna do that. Pop. We just wait. We're playing chicken style. Buck, buck, buck. Now's a good time to say, if you enjoy this, if this helps you, do drop a like. Click like, finger the like if you're on your phone. Do what you gotta do. We have plenty of walkthroughs for professional, for all types of people, all kinds of styles. If you're starting uh, your uh, New Game Plus, you can get the Chicago typewriter if you want to do that. And then professional, we have a guide for that. And now this is just the fun one. This is one for people who want to spend, it costs me 10 bucks for three tickets. I think in America it's like five bucks. So I know most of you are American. I see the stats, I got analytics. Five bucks, pay to win, be professional, get infinite ammo, and then probably never play through again. That's fine, I get it. I played through professional a couple times. We're gonna make this look so easy. This is gonna be easier than your sister on prom night, man. This is gonna be, it's gonna be nuts. Just like your sister on prom night. Look at this, this is this is just dumb. This is just so stupid. We just gotta kill a bunch of them and kill a bunch of time. Our only threat is chainsaw, man. If he gets too high, we'll uh, grenade the floor and then peace out, okay? That's the plan, that's the play. And then we'll make our way to shotgun house and then we'll pretty much be wrapping up. Who's coming? Who's coming next? We've got plenty of bullets. Here we go. All right, we don't have a lot of hand cannon stuff, so we're going to hand gun. All right, we're going to equip your grenade. I can always get past the goddamn typewriter. There we go. Chuck it down, and we're going down. That was not my fault. That's a big explosion. There we go. All right, grab as much as you can as you go. Just make a straight run for the house, or else you might get chainsawed in the back. I don't know how he catches up, but he does. If you get grabbed, you're done for. All right, this is easy. We'll grab a shotgun. Now that won't be equipped. So we'll have to uh, equip that. Make some space. All right, I'm pretty happy with that. Small resources we're gonna be selling in the future once we have our infinite stuff. The only thing we want is large resources to make flashbang grenades. Small ones can get the hell out of here. I think we're done. I think we're, like, that's it. We're gonna grenade down here with the grenade we just got. There'll be a whole group of people. There they are. And that's it. Oh! Ta-da! Easy, right? You're wondering what the hell? Why have I never done that before? Easy. All right, skip. We're gonna run, grab some stuff, grab some goodies, skip this. If you wanna skip comms, pause, and then triangle, and then you're good. We're gonna be coming back through this village a few times, and there's not really much to get. There's a velvet blue up top, but we'll get that because we have to go past that later. We're gonna grab some resources. We're gonna grab a gem or a ruby or something sapphire in one of these ones. The one on the left has it, but this one has handgun ammo. That's not really helpful for us. Wrong way. A ruby, there we go. I knew it was a ruby. All right, this next area, we're just gonna breeze through. There are blue medallions, which we can come back for later, but like we don't, we don't need spinals, spinals. Whatever the hell they're called. Because we we're we gonna use our exclusive tickets that we already got. Again, if you are doing the non-DLC exclusive ticket playthrough, you're watching the wrong video. We have a five hour in-depth, super serious playthrough that you can watch and follow that. I, I used like a playthrough that was poor, so that it inspires you because it's kind of like, well, if you do so poorly and you make so many mistakes and still get through professional, me learning from your mistakes means it's gonna be so easy for me. 
So watch that one. It's five hours. It's very in depth. It's very detailed on boss fights. We'll show you how to do things, expect things, and just have a good time. So here we're just cruising through. We're gonna stab the lady inside, and then we're just gonna grab the cog and then peace out and like not see anybody. It's gonna be delightful. So great. So this lady. Stab her. Alright. That went south, but then went okay in the end. You don't have to stab her, okay? You can ignore her, but I wanted to. She had it coming. In the past life, she was a bitch to me. Grab this. And we're done! We're gonna get out of here! That's it! You don't have to fight anybody. There's no threat in this area. Unless you're going for blue medallions. And even still, you just do them before you get that cog. And then we pull this. And now our explosive is still in place. And there's gonna be someone who runs in there. We just gotta wait for them to blow up. Come on, lady, pick up the pace. There we go. Ta da! And we're done. We just run. We just jog out of here. Bull Man will follow the path that we took, so he's got a long way to go. He's chunky and slow. And then he's gonna sprint across this bridge while wearing a mask. He's gonna be puffed. Push this cart with backup helmets. Liam probably could just climbed over it, squeeze through, but no, he has to push it so far. He's not the smartest guy. Luckily, he's good looking. That gets him through all of this, really. We got time. All right, duck through here. You don't want to keep running. Don't miss that little walkway. We're going to equip your shotgun because this lady always, always charges at you. You don't want to get stabbed and die because that would suck. Boom. Sucked in, lady. And that's it, we're good, baby. We're gonna go to this next area. We'll keep the shotgun out, maybe. Maybe that's probably... Yeah, that's about... We don't have much ammo on that. We'll keep that out. We're gonna be selling it later, anyway. Just gonna breeze us through here so we can avoid taking much damage. Or well, hopefully any damage. Now we'll get stabbed, man. And stab sucks. All right, good duck to the left. Literally. See what we got. We're, we're pretty full, aren't we? We're not going to be grabbing any of this stuff. Okay. A little knife to that. All right, let's go. Just blast them. Cruise through. Try to avoid bear traps. Stick to the right. Blast. Dynamite man. Don't worry about him. Blast. All right, we'll bust this. And then we go. They won't come for us in here. They don't. I don't know whose house this is, but they don't want to go in here. Probably this angry man who's banging on the floor. I don't think there's anything good in this house. Is there? Nah, just resources. They can suck it. We don't have space for any of this stuff, man. Lich, oh, come on. We're getting even... Alright. Alright, that's fine. That's cool. That's cool. Get rid of this. There we go. Now we've got space. Alright. This guy, you can completely ignore him. I'm going to stab him. Because we're going to have an invincible knife, so... It doesn't really matter. Stabby, stabby. Oh yeah, if you want the invincible knife, we're gonna save here so you can get the, if you haven't got it already. We're going to get all the clockwork Castellans, follow that guide, get them all. You gotta play through the entire game, or if you've saved at each chapter. It's very easy to get. They're not very difficult to find. You'll be fine. Use the guide. All right, I'm gonna save here, because I kept a little secret from you. My daughter is asleep, and she's about to wake up. So, <laughs> we're coming back in a minute. Save the game. You don't have to save here. I would save before the fish, but for me, I gotta. We're back, baby! Chapter two. What was hours for me, seconds for you? Chapter two. Here we go. So, you could have avoided that save because the village wasn't too difficult. So, normally I'd say, oh, because the village is difficult save but because we made it such a breeze i wouldn't have saved there but i had to i had no choice so we're one save on ding 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 with this playthrough you can literally save wherever you want because we're going to go through so many sections stabby stabby 
All right, this guy, because this, they want you to get through this, this guy's super weak. So you can just knife him. I can't believe I knifed his knife multiple times. <laughs> what are the odds? Not a threat. Not a threat, man. Because you don't have guns, so they weaken that guy. Don't forget this. What is in here? Sapphire? Sapphire. Nice. And I bust these so I don't have to run around and like a chump, like an idiot. And then repeat that whole section again and again and again. Because that would suck. And I don't want to do that. Come here. I don't have to do this, by the way. I'm just doing it because why the hell not? All right, this guy. We're just going to crouch. You could rush him and jump. Like I said, they're weak. They've been made weaker because the game knows we only have knives. And if you want to get this rat, now's the time to do it. Yeah, ratty, ratty, ratty. Yeah, hey, buddy. Come on, buddy. We're just having a good time here, rat. At your expense. This is gonna be fun. Oh, I'm so I'm enjoying this. All right, we're gonna open this up. You know this. You've done this. You beat the game before. Just in case you suck, we're gonna run. We're gonna jump this wall as quick as you can. You can just run around mashing A if you want. If you're that paranoid that you're gonna miss a window, no, it's gonna go through here because the uh, bear trap is gone. It's busted. Nothing to worry about. I think we can take all this. We're gonna sell it all anyway. Because we're about to get our sweet, sweet reward. Now, we're going to do some of the requests and stuff and collect treasures because we want to upgrade our weapons. Who's that? In our non-commentary playthrough, we kind of just rushed through, Welcome. mucked around a little bit. We didn't really collect treasures. But because we want to tune up our guns, we are going to want money. Money, money, money. All right, so exclusives, hand cannon, freebie. Ding, ding, ding. Unlimited ammo, never has to reload. Same with this. So we're gonna use a mix of the Chicago Sweeper and Hand Cannon. The last playthrough, we kind of used the Hand Cannon exclusively because it's an easier weapon to get than the Chicago Typewriter or Sweeper, whatever the hell it's called. And we'll make this invincible. All right, we can sell everything that we want. We don't need that, not using that. Combat knife, don't need that. Handgun, shotgun. And that's it. Thank you. All right, we're going to go to this next area. Now, if, if you want to, you could have, if you didn't save at the start of the chapter, you could save here if you want to. There's all the dynamite here, but again, it's not, it's not too threatening. You're gonna be okay. I'll get you through this. You're gonna make it look like chum. Now you've got an infinite hand cannon. The main skill with this is getting its accuracy down, its patience, okay? It's a patient weapon. Slow it down, let it target, and then fire. You're gonna do more damage, and you're gonna hit what you want, okay? You're gonna be fine. Close range, you can blast, but at a distance, you can hit things at a distance, okay? Don't let anyone tell you you can't. Like, here we go, we got dynamite guys and stuff. Just patience, boom, look at that. Lady up here, patience. Dead. Buddy, dead. See? It's just like a rifle. When they're not rushing you. <laughs> ah, you're gonna be fine. You're gonna, this is gonna be great. You're gonna have a great time. I really wanna hit this guy. I think I can do it. Yeah, knew it. All right, there's one more guy we're gonna deal with, but we're gonna jump down and do it. Hey, buddy, buddy. All right, I'm gonna try not to hit the barrel, but I think I will. Nah, I knew I would. Boom skis. All right, let's get to work. A lot of explosives about to go off, so be ready for that. Let's get inside. We'll do some business inside. You could try and run through this, but I, I mean, why risk it? Why play stupidly? Because then you might just end up having to play it again. We got a small key. Kablamo. Don't come back to life. Oh, wait, no, then if the head's gone, I don't think they're coming back, are they? All right, this is a safe place. It's like from Dynamite, you're pretty safe here. I'm going to say 100% safe because some could come through the top, but I'm going to say pretty safe. Let's have some fun. They come through my window, buddy. Oh, physics defying torso. Oh, is that a triple kill? 
Very nice. Alright, patience in this is important. I know you're thinking, but I only got five and a half hours. It's heaps of time. Oh, dynamite man. Get the hell out of my house. This is Leon's home now. I live here. All right, <laughs> that's them for now. There'll be more. There's always more. They'll just keep coming. I hear a guy jump or fall or tumble. He'll come. He'll, he'll get here eventually. Let's head up top side. This is where our little uh, hexagon thing is we want. I think all our dynamite throwers are dealt with. There you are, my man. Alright, some runners will come. Oh, this guy, point, a pointer, usually runs. He wasn't in the mood this time. Come on, come on. Alright. You didn't make much progress, Mouth, or you're coming closer. Sucks to lose a leg. I assume. I hope I never know that. There we go, this guy's running, he's enthusiastic. Running days are over, sorry buddy. Right, there's a dynamite guy up here, you can pick him up in the distance. Here they come. Look at this, this is like, this is like so chill, isn't it? Usually this is action packed area. Explosions and stuff, but this is... <laughs> you wouldn't even know there's people here. I'll shoot the barrel if I have to. Nah, I got him. Look at that. Just for fun. Alright, this old lady. Don't stab me in the back. I'm just gonna open this up. Nope, I'm gonna kick that first. Oh, you were, you were miles away. You're so loud. Come on. That was a big fall. She felt that one. She get older, your knees are uh, not so great. Oh, Jumbo, right in the head. Alright, we're done here, man. There might be another dynamite person rocking up, but we're pretty much, we're pretty much done. We're gonna grab a first aid spray just down here in the little house. Maybe we'll grab some money too. Well, like I said, we need money. We need cash. Stab me, lady. My Google is going off. Quiet, lady. Quiet. All right. Like I said, we want to upgrade our stuff. There's our dynamite guy. I don't know where the hell you late, buddy. It's over. We're done. You get to live. Maybe I'll see you later. I'll see you at the after party, right? That's a good throw. Alright, hexagon time. We're done with that area. It was a breeze, right? Oh, with the hand cannon, too. Everyone said it's super inaccurate. It sucks. It's terrible. I hate it. It seemed alright to me. So when I shoot barrels, I'm gonna follow my rule of if it's red, I don't want it. If it's yellow, I might get it. I want money. I want cash. And these guys seem to store all their cash in fish barrels. Genius. I've got some new items. Welcome. I would I've like to sell. Thank you. All right, ready to fire up. Ready to fire is nice and cheap. Power is gonna cost you. It's gonna be expensive. We haven't used our sweeper much yet. Should we? Should we do a little bit of sweeping? It's not as quick. It'll get there. It'll get there. There'll be situations where we want it. There'll be situations where we don't. I will guide you through it, and I'll show you which ones where it works best. But it's really up to you. Just have a good time. We don't want to miss this treasure because we want money. You can miss it. I don't. I don't care. You do what you want. But I want it. I want that blue, blue sapphire. It's only seconds. It only takes seconds. I'm gonna have so much time that all these little things are not gonna add up to a thing. They're not gonna matter. You won't even notice. Money! Thank you, bird. That's a rich bird. Alright, watch out for bear traps. You don't wanna step in one. Not that you're going to die. Nothing bad is going to happen. But it could. Alright, another herb. We're going to have a lot of herbs. 
Okay, can I knife this? I swear I can. Ah, shit. That's okay. <laughs> Mr. I want money, fuck that up. Alright, chainsaw guy. Dr. Salvador, whatever the hell you want to be called. Just never die, do you? We think you're dead, and then you come back. You're the same man or you're a different man. And sneak up on a guy. Oh, lady. Sucks to be you. Ah, oh, god damn it. I didn't see it because they were on top of it. So you can crawl on that and not have it trigger? Yeah, come on. Chicago Sweeper is great at blowing things up. Also, great at taking out bear traps. This gun is super inaccurate at range. But wherever you're aiming, it'll eventually hit because it fires so quickly. <laughs> you just gotta kinda be patient. I'm gonna stick to the right. We'll kill this guy on the toilet. Hey, buddy. I'm pooping your pants on. Grab everything now. There's a small key. Really, that's all we need. Alright, it's puzzle time. We gotta solve this padlock. Once you know it, you know it. I was actually trying to pick that up, but sure. We go, baby. Piggy. There we go. I don't know why I was doing that backwards, but that's where it started me. So, sure. Alright, big fella, come on. Come on, buddy. There we go. Oh, he kept kicking. Double tap. We need some more power in our gun. Alright, red herb to the left. It'll be here if you miss it. Don't worry. Calm down. Solve this. Roll it forward. Roll it sideways. And just adjust. Ta-da! Mendez. I don't know how Mendez knew he was going to look like that. All his insignias and stuff. It's the exact shape he becomes later. Spoil. You played this game. I don't, I'm not spoiling anything. Alright, let's keep going. We don't need to say. We're fine. We're okay. We're chugging. We're chugging along. Everything is groovy. Everything is great. Nothing to worry about, baby. Now, there's a guy that lets dogs out up ahead. We can try and ice him and it stops the dogs. But, the dogs aren't really going to be a threat, so it doesn't matter. I'm going to try a couple pot shots at him. Nailed him before, but sometimes I get, I don't know, spam happy. Which, again, is not what you want to do with the hand cannon. What is in here? Money, a hundred bucks. I don't know what the conversion rate is, but I'm sure that's not very much. Oh! Oh, because I moved. Oh well, like I said, he lets dogs out or something. If you kill him, the dogs aren't there. But, who gives a shit? We'll be lucky if we even see them. Because all we're going to do is run down here and we're going to go right. I want to see these dogs, man. So we bust this. Hey, there they are. Nothing. Lady in the door. Cap it. Take your money. Guy. Shoot him. There's a lady and a green herb. If you didn't pick up the green herb in the village fight, because if you're following along perfectly, I didn't pick it up, you can pick it up now. Because if you run here, you get boxed in. That would suck. That's why we didn't do it. Alright, in we go. Snake. Next. If you want to do that, do I have room? Alright, let's get crafting. You crafty boy. There we go. We're going to sell in a second anyway. Alright, there's a treasure. We're not going to get every single treasure. Don't treat this as like a treasure guide. First aid in here. Don't be like, oh, you didn't fall forget every treasure, you missed one. Who cares? <laughs> okay? <laughs> Simple as that. Who cares? We'll do it, we're doing what we do. Alright. Merchant man, I got some junk to sell to you, man. I want this. We're gonna be making flash grenades. It's gonna help you in the future, don't worry. 
Viper. What do we got? Ammo. I don't need this crap. All right. There we go. Do you have space for flash grenades? A smaller? Yeah. These ones take up three flash grenades. Take up two. Coolio. All right. What have we got over here? Money. A couple of barrels here. And is there two to the left? No. There will be though. Someone comes and places them when we come back through here. I don't know why. Nice person replenishing. All right, there's a little hut to my right that I've not really been in. I'm gonna go in there. Church. You want to destroy these? Now's a good time. What do you got in your house, man? Let's have a little look. I haven't been in here since my per first playthrough. Because there's no need. Unless... No. Garbage. Don't bother going in there. Ain't a goddamn thing. Now I feel bad because he didn't drop anything. Traded his life for nothing. Alright, skip. I think we got a phone call. Skip. Now, I used to open that gate. You don't have to. We are going to get this yellow gem, though. Yellow diamond. Ooh. Same thing, goddammit. Wee! Alright, we're gonna cruise through this area. It's not too difficult. Just deal with any guys who throw things, like this guy. Old man! I'm gonna ignore that room for now. We'll get it later. There's a snake in there. But well, there's a whole bunch of snakes where we're going. Come on. There you are. Alright, let's go up. Molotov, man, we'll throw a Molotov, but they put this little roof thing here to kind of like block it. So he's most likely to miss. It's more of a threat. So the idea that he's throwing one at you. The odds that he hits you seem to be pretty slim. I don't think I've ever been hit by him. I could have. I just don't remember. Right. Double trouble. Oh, double kill. Money, money. There's some barrels around here, but you don't have to get them. You don't want to. Now, our, our first, like, save, the place where I would actually save is coming up soon. Once we do the fish farm, that's where I would save before actually fighting the fish. Because just because you fought it before doesn't mean it's going to go well every time. Sometimes you make a mistake. Sometimes he lands on you. Ooh. Sometimes he lands on your boat. You just got to be ready for that, okay? So we'll save before we fight the fish. And you'll be having a great time. You'll have a good time. It'll be fun. Use the hand cannon there. <laughs> I wanted to try it. Uh, there are these. I guess we could get all these medallions. Better do at least one of them. That's it. Uh, if you throw a grenade in there, you can clean up all the crows. But I didn't have any. Got another ruby. Ooh la la. So this is the area you would save, but not yet. Fish farm is easy. You're going to be fine. You've got your hand cannon. There's not really many surprises there. They're going to be like, oh my god, I didn't see that coming. Now I'm dead. You're going to be okay. Look at all the heals we got. We're fine. We're stuck, man. In fact, you can buy more if you want. You do you. That's yours. Small resources we sell. And the ammo. And we're happy. Yay, we'll buy that. Alright, we can't buy a case or a first aid spray. I will buy a couple of cases. I don't know when he stocks them, but he stocks them pretty big. You can just wait till you buy the big one, but that's probably going to annoy me. So I'll probably end up caving and buying one soon.
There's a medallion in this area. We will destroy it when we get on the boat. Oh, good shooting, man. Four hundred bucks. That was worth it. That's a good chunk of change. All right, we cross through here. We'll fall through the floor. Whoa! We'll find some snakes in here because we skipped that other one. We'll get some snakes, but we'll deal with big man. Not so scary, is he? What a chump! And then we'll have some goons slowly walking towards us. We'll also deal with them. Oh, double snake. That's what we want. I can get him. Now these guys are going to take up space, which is a shame. Since we can't pick up too many goodies. Oh, oh, oh jump. Well, we want the snakes. All right, medallion in here. You can't knife it, just shoot it. We're also going to get a couple of treasures in here, too. And a hexagon piece. Ah, dick. What'd you get, man? <laughs> I was about to eat the snake. No, we need to sell them. Use the ones with health first, so that way your health is extended. That's just, that's just smart. That's just common sense. Like, if you got a yellow herb and something, use that first. And in the future, you will have more health overall. What have we got? Two more medallions in this area. Last one's just at the end. We're gonna go grab a treasure. Don't know what it is. What are you? An antique pipe. How fancy. That's a bit better than a little ruby or a gem. Where are my goons at? I know there's people around. Ah, they'll catch up. They'll catch up. All right, we're gonna get the next medallion in a sec. And a dog or something? Is that what I'm thinking of? Either way, we're gonna duck under here. There we go. So the last one, like I said, is next to the boat. Ah, oh, hexagon piece. Why well, I think it was a dog? Because I'm an idiot. Night, Grandma. Snakes everywhere, man. This place... The fish farm or a snake farm? Goddamn. Chicken egg. Boat fuel. This is what I'm you could just call it fuel, but just in case you don't know what the fuel is for, they call it boat fuel. I've seen some of you guys solve puzzles. I make, got, I make guys for puzzles. And I've seen some of the reactions to those puzzles. So I completely understand why Capcom called it boat fuel. Otherwise... There'd be a lot of people being like, fuel? What do I do with the fuel? I'm looking for stuff for the boat. Yes. Yes, you are. <laughs> it, it, trust me. I get it. Debs, I get it. All right, what we got? Who we got coming to our party now? There's a crossbow lady, right? Where the crossbow me? Don't do it, lady. Don't do it. I don't think she was gonna do it. She looked like she wasn't gonna do it. I feel a little bit bad. Looks like she didn't really know what was going on. Everyone's like, there's trouble at the fish farm. She just followed along. How did you catch up? You were quick, man. Not now, you got that leg gone, but you were quick. All right, let's go save. This is what I say. I say save here, because this fish thing can go south pretty quick. We're going to do the best we can to keep it from going south. But just in case, you don't want to die here. So this is where I'd say save first. I know I've saved already. I told you why. Full time dad. Go look after my kid. But a mum's home soon. So we're safe. And we'll come back to this. Right on. Let's, let's deal with this fish, man. So we fine. This will be easy. No one noticed that cut, did they? No. 
I didn't go anywhere. Mummy's home now. The only thing we got coming is a swimming lesson tonight. So, I got, we got time. We got time to avoid saving. We can deal with this fish and a whole bunch of other stuff before we have to save again. You can say when you- Ah, oh, I forgot to sell my stuff! What an idiot! Okay, we can craft this at least. We'll make a stop. When we do the boat section, we'll make a little uh, unscheduled stop to the merchant. Because I forgot to sell stuff. What happens when you have a little break? When you pause? Alright, I'm not going to forget the medallion though. I'm on, I'm switched on with that. Oh ho ho! So inaccurate, this hand cannon. Alright, we got one more hexagon piece to find. We'll find that when we're on the boat. We get that in the small cave. And we'll solve that hexagon puzzle. But for now, we could deal with this fish. So my understanding of this is a little all over the place. I feel like the longer you leave Leon to wind up, the more damage you do. So in our first full commentary playthrough, it took us 30 shots to kill this guy. It was a lot. Let's see if we can do it in less. Thing is, I forgot to count. Someone count. <laughs> Someone go back and count. Come on, buddy. You want to jump. You know you want to jump. Big jump. Big jump, big fella. Nope. Okay. That went for miles, man. He threw it into the cliff. All right, let it wind up. Come on. There we go. That's pretty good. Uh, no. Don't eat me. Don't eat me. All right, in the mouth. Yeah, so I swear, like, with the wind up, it's like... Say it has a set amount of damage. Let's say it starts at 10. So if you're spamming them out, you're doing 10 damage a shot. But if you let it wind up, it'll be like 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60. And then bam. I could be making that up. I have no idea. I have no way of knowing how to confirm that. Nice try, ass. It almost took me to that tree. Here we go. Big wind up. Big wind up. Come on, big fella. There we go. Oh, that was a big wind up hit. And another. Come on, fish boy. Where'd you go? I spun <laughs> way too far. Went the long way. Alright, how are we looking? Boat's looking pretty good, didn't get much damage. Gonna jump. Cornering yourself, yeah, that's what I thought. But I didn't get to throw. Wouldn't let me. Here you go, big jump, big jump, big fella. Oh, you're doing spaz jumps. How you jumped over there and ended up over there, I don't know. But I'll roll with it. Come on, buddy. Come on. I can tell you're just a couple of hits away. Don't do it! Right into the tree, ass. Ah, oh, I missed a big jump! That would have been the perfect one. I would have finished him, I reckon. There we go, there we go. That was in the side, not in his mouth. I think the mouth does more damage. Everything I'm saying is speculation. I have no idea how this fight works. I just know every time I do it, it ends up being different. <laughs> it goes either really well or really poorly, and I barely make it out. This one, I'm going to say, is okay. Come on, one more hit, surely. Okay, okay, we're doing this again. Nailed him. Come on, die, buddy. I was close. That was a little scary. I do wonder if you take too long if he just one hits you and goes, that's enough. Homp, chomp, done. Hey, we are done. All right, we're not gonna save. We'll be fine. We're gonna keep cruising through, baby. We should be able to hang on for quite a while. I don't know where our next save will be. 
I'm gonna cruise through all of this. I think we got like, look, mm, 40 minutes before I gotta get ready for swimming class. Not for me. Take my baby swimming. She's moved up a class. She's in second class. 16 to three year olds. 16 months to three year olds. Not 16 year olds. These are important facts for this playthrough, okay? All right, big fella. And your little friend too. Hey man. I'm with me, don't whip me. What'd I just say? If you want, you could run past these guys without getting hit. But I'm money hungry. I need cash. I wanna upgrade both weapons. I feel like normally if you rush to play through, you'll only be able to upgrade one gun barely, like max it out. I don't wanna do that. We barely upgraded the hand cannon in the last playthrough by rushing. We're gonna take our time. And I feel like overall by taking our time, we're actually gonna do better because we might even be quicker because we'll have more power. And we're also not using the hand cannon exclusively. There are areas where the hand cannon will not do great. Like the Krauser boss fight or, uh, what else? I don't know. When we get there, you'll know. Oh yeah, I gotta sell. We gotta sell stuff. Right, let's go visit the merchant. Let's, um, should I eat that egg? I don't know. That should fit. There we go. Ta-da! All right. Let's visit the merchant and sell our stuff. Or should we go, should we do, I don't know. Maybe we should, maybe we should. Cause there's not much to pick up here. I think there's really only a flashbang. Like we're not gonna get any. Oh, actually there's a yellow herb, but we can craft that. So we'll do this quickly. So I always say do the more difficult areas first, so that way you know if you're going to stuff up or not. Because there's nothing worse than... I can't, I'll just discard it then. I just want to, I wanted to eat it. Goodbye little leg. I could chuck it at him. Alright chumps. Yeah, so that way... Ooh, dynamite guy. Nice try, ass. And if you're going to change, you're going to change. If you die, then you're not going, you know, spend 20 minutes doing all this easy stuff and then do the difficult stuff and die. And they're like, great, now I'm gonna do it all again. That'll just demotivate you. So this is the hardest part of this area. And by hard, I mean, there's enemies. That's it. <laughs> it's not, not hard as in, oh my God, I barely made it out of here. There's gonna be a breeze. Trust me. Dynamite man, be careful where you throw it. And hate for you to hit yourself, which he did. You gonna change? You're gonna change. Don't even think about it, chump. You too? I get it, we just learned that they can change, so now everyone has to change. All right, we done? Good. We'll be coming back this, oh, actually no, we won't be coming back this way. We'll be a little bit past there. Don't care, don't want it. What dynamite man have? Money. All right, this puzzle, we're gonna go top left, top right, bottom. I forgot I had to plug my charger in. We're all good now, baby, we're all cruising now. Don't want my controller to go flat. Back up, buddy. Next. Little treasure to our right. I recommend the sweeper. It's also a yellow herb down below. Hey, 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 come on, man. Are we throwing fire at people? Who does that? How many times I gotta teach you that lesson, old man? Alright, we can craft this up. So that's really the most important thing we gotta pick up here is that and this. Now we've done that, we can head to the merchant. 
still are snakes. It's those damn snakes that are taking up space. Not the end of the world. Uh, we're gonna skip the treasure. If you keep going, there's a treasure and stuff up there, but oh well. We'll skip it. It's not that important. It's a little bit of money. Or is it a little lot of money? I don't know. It's like a bangle or something. Whatever the hell a bangle is. A bracelet? I don't know. I can't remember what it is. Took care of hey, chump! I knew I could count on you. This is for you. I got some snakes. Some ammo. And we're good. That's yours. Enjoy. We need a lot of money, as you can see. By the big case. Alright, that should help us uh, stop having problems for a little bit. We have to come back here anyway, so... This is an unnecessary stop. Only because I forgot that I hadn't sold my snakes. I should have sold my snakes and then saved. But no. So if you were doing well, like if, ideally if I didn't have, you know, other duties outside of just sitting playing games. We'd really have only saved once, which would have been at the fish boss fight. We'll grab this guy. He's a big fish. Leon also is a second spear for some reason. Mystery of life. All right, we'll do this, because we didn't go to the treasure, we'll do this a little bit out of, out of sync. We'll go over here. We've got a gun we can sell. It's money. And there's some treasure here as well. So the treasure we get. An Alexandrite. It's cash in the bank, baby. And the gun we can sell. We're not going to use it. If you followed our uh, other playthrough, our normal professional playthrough, that's the gun. That's the handgun we use. The Red Nine. Let's go visit some chickens. Bok bok. Grab that golden egg, which we're going to sell. We're also not going to do the golden egg Salazar trick. Because I feel... Takes... Just as much time to do it normally as it does to go and get the egg and then throw it at him. So, I'm not going to bother. But, if you want to, that's the thing you can do. But, because we've got the Chicago Sweeper and the Hand Cannon, I've got to do it that way. I think it's going to be fine. It'll be great. You're not going to die. It might take a little long, like like a little longer than obviously throwing an egg at him. But the time it takes you to go and get that egg, we're going to be skipping. So it'll balance out. Good driving. Alright, there's some barrels here. We can just bop them and see what's in them. Nothing good. What about you, buddy? I do want money. Alright, we get our last piece of uh, the head and the hexagon here. So don't miss this. I'm sure you won't, but just in case. So we'll go solve that, because that's a nice little prize. Grab the head. We got space for things now. There's a treasure up the top here. A ruby. I think that's everything. I don't think there's barrels down here, is there? No. We're done. All right, let's cruise. We're going to go and place the heads. And then carry on. We're going to fight a giant. You'll be, you might be tempted to save before the giant, but it, it's not necessary. You don't really have to. Not that necessary. But if you feel concerned that he might combo you to death. That's fine. You can do that. So this puzzle, once you get here, follow my exact movements. Otherwise, you might spend some time trying to solve it. Or you might just give up. So once we place all the pieces, it's going to be right a couple of times, left a couple of times, top. So go one, two, one, Two, and then one. Easy. 
Maybe that's the dog thing I was thinking of. The depraved idol. All right, let's go place these heads and get the hell out of here. I know we all like driving boats. It's a little bit of fun, a little bit of something different. There's nothing really in this cave either, so any other little things popping up, don't even bother, because you'll just be end up reading text. Not that's a bad thing. I'm not saying reading's bad. I'm just thinking you did it the first time. And I'm under the assumption that you're worried about time for this. Don't call me, lady. Ain't got time. Probably a scammer anyway. This is Amazon. How can I help you? Stop fucking calling me. Scammer. It's always a robot as well. This is Amazon support. Your account has purchased a very expensive item. Was this you? I had someone call me. I come. I think it was. Oh yeah, your uh, Visa Mastercard, which I'm pretty sure is two different cards. So your Visa Mastercard has been used in America by John Smith. That's. I don't can't remember the name, but it's something like that. $2,000 on your Visa Mastercard by John Smith in America. Was this you? Yes. Didn't know what to say. Lady had no idea what to say. She's like, no, you don't understand. Someone, uh, we think it's fraudulent. No, no, that's me. It's cool. He can buy it. He's a tip, lady. Don't fucking scam people. Alright, we're stopped, baby. We're ready. We might buy some yellow diamonds later, with all our spinals, spinals. Like I said, you could save here, if you're concerned. I feel like sometimes he may triple hit you and down you in one go. But, I'm not worried enough about that. I think we're gonna be okay. Take our butterfly lamp, because we've got the hand cannon. This is, this is your go-to here, okay? Hand cannon. We're just gonna keep shooting him in the face. We may get hit, it might happen. He's a hard fella to dodge. He may just run at you or just w casually walk up to you while you try to outrun him and then punch you in the back of the head. It happens. But oh, we just go to town. Bang. Go for the face. There's his big friend. Just keep shooting him. Don't bother trying to hit the thing. Just keep shooting him. Your little dog friend comes in. See, like, what the hell? Where's my reaction time on that? Unexpected, man. All right, see, we've done so much damage, the dog's biting him. He'll run into a wall, a wall will fall on him. Now you can shoot the thing. Okay, now you can shoot the parasite, because it's gonna be right there. Cap it a couple times. And you're done. Wow. That was easy. Say so thank you to the doggy, and we're gonna go and pick up a velvet blue. Pretty sure Velvet Blue is a movie with Carl McLaughlin. Is that what I'm thinking of? I feel like that was a movie I watched. With Laura Dern, and it was by David Lynch, and they were held hostage by accident by these odd couple. And there was nudity in it. Thanks, bud. I would not. For someone who's not sure if that's a movie, that's a lot of detail. Look that up for me. Nothing to worry about here. Set the snake, we'll grab the snake. But we're gonna fight a dog in a second. And this dog takes a pounding. I don't know why he takes so many shots, but he does. Alright, there's another Viper before us. So like I said, we didn't open that big door because it turns out that you don't have to because the door's just going to be open. So I used to run down that little tunnel, go and open that door to make sure I can get out quicker. But then I was like, why did I do that? This always happens. This dog opens it. Go to town, baby. Go to town. Just keep him stun locked if you can. He doesn't like getting shot in the face. I mean, who does? 
There we go. All right, we're into the church. This is going well so far. We're gonna do the stained glass window puzzle. I'll give you some tips on that. I put up a video for that. I thought that was enough. I got a comment just before this went up. So, so like the video shows you how to solve this. And someone still asked, I need more detail, I, I, I don't understand. Mind blowing. I just, I don't get it. <laughs> it's just, it's so straightforward. We'll take this key. So, let's pull the lever. Let's get started. I recommend starting from blue. So, here, here's the thing I want to show you. When you do get it in the right position, it flashes gold. So, there's all these clues beyond the gold symbol and the gold and the symbol on your icons and the thing. But see, it flashes. When you get it in a good spot, it gives this nice pulse. It goes, yeah, maybe you should stop. So, do what you want, man, do what you want. Get in a nice spot. I always say pick uh, a shape. It's like with this one. Done. Just pick like a point. If there's a nice pointy edge, just match that up. Don't focus on the whole thing. Just focus on like one little point. And that's what you should go for. All right, let's save Ashley. We've solved that difficult, Ashley, difficult puzzle. You in there? Took us hours. My first playthrough took me about a week. Ashley. Now, Ashley's in her armor, in her knight armor. She's fine. We don't have to worry about her. Stress less. That's a fantastic frame right there. All right. Let's get that. A lady in a knight armor. Like, let's just assume she was in that room and that was in there. And she was like, I'm gonna put this on while I wait. And then my guy rocks up, Leon rocks up, dressed like he is with a chicken hat. Get the ladder. And she's like, well, uh, I can I get out of it? No, there's no time. Okay, I guess I'll wear this the entire run then. Wow, Leon wears that chicken hat. I know. I guess in a way, he is in a foreign country. Maybe he's going full tourist. What we got? Nothing good. Attachable mines. All right, there's a flash grenade that you might miss here. Spin around, pick it up. There's also treasure here. You don't want to keep running. Don't call me while I'm at work, lady. Pick this up. An elegant headdress. And there's no room for you, so... Flash grenade. We got a red herb, we can craft that. Perfect. Stay close. And again, we need a big case. We're gonna have so many heals. Your life is gonna be insanely easy. If you struggle with an area, you're gonna have heals through the roof. Then you're gonna be like, my god, I've got 50 first aids, so many herbs. I may as well become a chef. Don't get up, lady. Good lady. Hey buddy, don't throw it! Don't do it! What I say, man? I slowly stepped to the left and avoided that. I'm a badass. Let's murder all these guys. Not murder. Self-defense. I mean, let's defend ourselves from this swarm. Don't do it. Don't become a freaky head. Hey, hey, hey. <laughs> uh, so threatening. If I get hit by an axe, you can laugh at me, okay? I give you permission to laugh in my face. Don't do it! What about you, man? What are you doing? Cut that out. Okay, I think that's everyone except for a Molotov man. You gonna throw it? Good throw! That was pretty good. You almost had the distance. Your throwing days are over, buddy. Alright, back to Merchant Man. We're gonna sell our snakes. And here's those barrels I was talking about. I like it when I see yellow. I know the first time you play through the game, seeing yellow was just like, no, I wanna discard this. Get get the hell out of here. I'm trying to pick up gold. I don't want you, man. When you when you see yellow, it was always like, I don't want this, I want ammo, give me ammo. But now yellow is our go-to. Goodbye, goodbye. 
Goodbye, get out of my inventory. How's that? How are we doing for money? What we need? 50. 50,000 bucks. I think I'm made of money. I'm gonna buy a lot of first aid sprays. They will be 100% unnecessary. Just in case. Sorry, we need to keep Alright, what's in these barrels? It's fine. Now I was can we can we see everybody from here? Can we deal with this ahead of time? We're gonna fight the Savage Mutt. This is more like a revenge fight. If you watched our five hour playthrough, I recommended avoiding the Savage Mutt because of how difficult it is. It's a very challenging fight, it takes a lot of ammo. So this is gonna be cathartic. This is gonna be nice to like effortlessly kill this savage mutt. So that means we gotta go to the village chief's house again. We'll clear some of these goons out so we can have a nice savage mutt only fight. Don't do it lady. Oh, you got me good. Oh, you got me very good. I should have counted that. I'm gonna cut her arm off. Legit. I didn't sell my snake like an idiot. Wish I had a red herb so I can mix it with the yellow and green. Boom, man! Don't do it, lady! Duck! Alright, let's get some space. This guy's got some distance on us. Alright, big fella. We good? We done? We all happy? Not you. Okay, now... I think we're finished. Ah, oh, God. Let me leave. All right, let's go to the village chief's house. For the love, don't do it. Okay, okay, now we are done. We're gonna go to the village chief's house. We're gonna get an antique camera to sell. So basically we're a thief. We go up into his attic and we go, ooh, this looks good. But we have to go up there to trigger the dog. So we go to the village chief's house, and then as we leave, the dog will be here at the gate. And he's unkillable. I've tried to kill him so many times at the gate. I thought just like a nice, clean, heavy damage shot would just end it, but nah, it's all scripted. I forgot where the stairs were. Open this. All right, Ashley, get up there. Okay. Get to work. How we doing for time? I think we got like 20 minutes before I gotta save at some point. If you're worried about this savage mutt, if you don't trust me, you can save here. If you're like, no, it's gonna kill me, save here. I don't mind. I'm not gonna judge you. You're gonna have like, let's see. I'm gonna save the mine carts. <laughs> You're gonna have a lot of saves. I can only, well, I think I can, the mine carts. That's the only part I can think of. We might save before Mendez, but that's not a difficult fight. Yeah, let's say let's say you, we've got two saves I can think of that we're gonna do. So you're gonna have a lot of saves. If you want to save there, you can save. One day, man. One day, that's gonna surprise me. But I'm gonna save in, in the next 20 minutes because, like I said, we got swimming class. So we gotta do it. And then I will be back. And we'll keep going. So we might have a few extra saves just to uh, general life duties. If you've got the same, feel free to save. You're gonna have so many saves, it's gonna be insane. Let's bring him up here. We're gonna use a flash grenade. Actually, I probably could've gone straight down. This is, this is where I go in the non hand cannon -y play. All right, we're gonna flash him and then we're just gonna hand cannon him. Does he not know I'm here? Come on. Hey, look, here I am. All right, go to town. That's the end of him. Perfect. <laughs> 
Let's get the other treasures here, since we saved so much time killing him so quickly. Because I can't remember what's in here. I've only ever gotten this in my first playthrough. We can find out together. How exciting. I need you to open it from the other side. It's a good looking game. We're playing on PlayStation 5. Elegant Fango. Oh, the other thing, I don't know if I mentioned this. I mean, it should be noted. We're not doing any door skips or anything. You know how, like, people are spinning on the ground and skipping through doorways? I don't think that helps you. I think you're just asking for trouble there, if that's where you're... Like, if you, if you do it now, but if you're on console, and in the future you're watching those back, and people are like, yeah, just do this, and it's like, I can't. That They fix that. That would suck. So we're just doing this how I feel it should be done. No cheating, no glitches. Everything is obtainable. Everything is doable. Don't do it, big head. Get out of my face. All right, go to the cabin fight. Ooh la la. We'll do these medallions in this farm. I can remember them. For some reason, when you use a hand cannon, it doesn't alert the others. Getting spotted does. Don't change, buddy. Oh, am I gonna hit that pig? I think I did. I'm sorry, pig. Look at this guy, he doesn't care. What about you, bull man? Oh, you care. That's a nice run you've got going there. I love that run. And your classic rock star pose. All right, let's do the medallion thingies. That's one. I generally remember these. And there's one in this little barn. I'm, I can't remember one. There's one I've forgotten. I can't think of it. Because there's a little barn and then, hey, 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 back off. I'm thinking, man. There's this one. And then up top, where's the last one? I don't remember. <laughs> I made the guide on this. Oh, I forgot my last playthrough as well. Don't text me. I'm busy, goddammit. I don't know where it is. I forgot. <laughs> ah, what the hell. Let's go do the cabin fight. Where is... I'm gonna have to look that up. I can't believe I forgot. I forgot last time as well. I feel so dumb. Again, is it important? No, not really. I could have oh, just grabbed the paper and checked the map. Wow, oh, what the hell. Dumb, dumb. All right, buddy, don't stand there, man. You're in the way. Because if I shoot you and you die, you need to go stand somewhere else. Oh, I'm warm, baby. Don't stand there, man. Get out the fuck away. <laughs> Let's get crafting. So many flash grenades. <laughs> All right, there's a barrel. You can shoot that if you want. Buddy, I need you to stand on this side. I want to stand here, but if you're gonna stand in my way, get the fuck out of the way. Why are you standing there? You never stand there. Dude, I'm gonna blow your brains out. And then the game's gonna be like, you killed Lewis, he's dead. Like, dumbass. I want to get hit because he's there. I'm telling you. Because he doesn't have armor. Buddy, you are in my way. So, buddy, look. Oh, you fucking ass. Are you... Are you... 
You my friend or what, man? Fucking hell, Lewis. <laughs> you son of a bitch. If he, can, if he makes one little peep about being, hey, watch where you're shooting. I'm gonna slap him. what I just say, man? You complain about where my shots go? That's on you. You were in the way. Next. Stand back there. I don't care, man. Just get out the way. All right, there's gonna be some chimney dudes. Some here you go. You hear the tumble? Get out! I'm trying to box this up, buddy. Where's chimney man? Get out of the way! How are you always in the way, dude? How did you make it this far? Honestly, don't do it. Just want to get to that window, please. All right, let's get to our spot. Let's get to our happy little spot. Get out of my way, man. All right, Lewis should stand over here. All right, so that, see how it's all free? The so Lewis should stand in the right corner. And that's where life is great. Or go upstairs. I don't care where he goes, just as long as he's out of my way. How easy was this? I think we're done. Big fella comes in. I want that herb though. Nice red one too. All right, chunky monkey. Say good night. That's it. We are done. Ta-da! All right, we're, we're approaching the Mendez fight. We're a few minutes out. That's where we will save next. Cause I gotta, I gotta go soon. One la oh, I don't know. Let's see how far we can go. Cause what, we're up to the Chainsaw Sisters? What's, what's... I think we'll be okay. We'll push it to the limit, baby. Let's just focus on getting out of here. Yeah, right. All right, we've got Merchant Man coming up. See what we can sell, see what we can buy, see what we can upgrade. Now, if you watch my five hour playthrough, we got to here with like nothing, nothing. It was insane. And we beat the Chainsaw Sisters. We had to use a knife to finish off some dudes. That's how crazy it got. It went bonkers. It was a great showcase of like, if I can survive without stuff, you'll be fine with stuff. As long as you've got a few more resources than I had, you were fine. Okay. That is plenty. Choices, man. Choices. If you want a fighting chance out there, you see I'm going to be using that against him, so it's probably Better best I actually upgrade that. Grab another one of these. And I'm happy. I think we're all good. Let's see if we can kill these uh, Molotov ladies from here. Because we can see him. Yeah, we can see him. I can do it. Can I see that one? Hmm. Maybe. Did I piss you guys off? Yeah, I did. Okay, I get it. I'd be mad too if someone shot my grandma from a distance. Come on, get a nice line on her. Let's tumble, big head. Oh, pig man, pig man, pig man. Oh, so close. Okay, that fucking hit. What the hell, lady? Who does that? Back up. Back up. Is that everybody? We done? We're gonna shoot some bear traps. Grab. Sometimes you get a green herb. Not this time. Maybe that's just when you're doing poorly. All right, bear traps. They're not a threat, but I'm just gonna shoot them anyway. Everybody's dead. That was a breeze, right? 
All right, Chainsaw Sisters, are you scared? Are you worried? Don't be. If you're in the same situation I am, you're gonna be okay. Good shot. Sometimes that guy transforms. This will not be one of those times. We're saving all our treasures for a big payday towards the end. So we're going to get through with the small upgrades. And then towards the end, we're going to do big upgrades and max out all our guns. Okay, that's the plan. So saving all our yellow diamonds and stuff. We're not going to waste them on cheap things. We want to put them on the pricier stuff. We want the big paydays. So don't be tempted to sell. Don't, be, don't get greedy now. It'll backfire. Alright, the only thing of note here is there's a yellow herb and a green herb. Probably a red herb somewhere. I don't know. Oh, and the treasure at the back. But we'll get we'll get that when we leave. You can get it now if you want to. Oh, we're doing some crafting. Should I eat some eggs soon? I got a little bit of damage. But I might be able to make it through this without. I don't. I mean, we're not gonna get hit. Okay, that's the main goal. Like, don't don't freak out. The chainsaws are gonna kill you. Oh yeah, and a first aid spray. There we go. Okay, hand cannon time. So we went through that door. So that way, if we need to, we can back through that door, and they'll just kind of funnel through. But hopefully, we'll just be able to down them in a couple of shots. And there we go. That's them done. Now we just deal with all the goons. They do drop from behind, so keep pay attention to back here. Because that's an, that's an alternate way in. So the way we went in is one way. That's an alternate way. Buddy, buddy, buddy. Okay, so that's that area done. We got whipped by a big head guy. That's a shame. Otherwise, we would have got through this pretty clean. But yeah, that's why we did the padlock area. So if you went into that padlock area, they only have one way of getting to you, and they'll pretty much only come through that doorway. I haven't really experienced them jumping down on top of us. Doesn't mean they won't. Ashton, you all right? Okay, let's go grab that treasure and get out of here. That's the chainsaw sisters dealt with. Nice and easy. What's in the barrels? Money, hell yeah, and a hand grenade. That's not a bad get. So we're approaching the Mendez boss fight. Everything's looking pretty good. We will save before the fight. Well, actually, we got time. We could, we, we'll save it for the boss fight, but we'll keep going. We're doing a late swim tonight. Ooh, 4:30. Okay, we are good. Yes. You did well back there. That's why I was just. That's why I messed up the crank. I was receiving new information about our day. Money. All right, this is a little uh, chasey chase that's about to happen. It's not too difficult, not too much to worry about. I don't know if you can fail with Ashley in the armor. Maybe if he grabs her, I don't know. But just keep running. Hand cannon's like a shotgun, so if anyone runs at you, you can just ice them. Just try not to be too slow. Let these guys rush you a little bit, and then shoot the barrel. 
You want them to get a little bit closer. And then, hey, 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 hey. I was thinking, man, I was thinking. Then we're done. Ta-da! All right. We're gonna save at this next point, and then we're gonna do the boss fights. We're only saving in case you make a mistake. You don't wanna get this far and then stuff up. We're not saving because it's difficult, because I'm gonna tell you all the tips to this boss fight that's gonna make it easy peasy lemon squeezy. And we're gonna be using both the Chicago Sweeper and the Hand Cannon, which is gonna make it much easier than if you watched my hand cannon only thing. Because once you get to the distance, it's kind of hard to deal consistent damage with the hand cannon quick enough. Especially when he's chucking red barrels, you don't want to be praying that you land a shot. So we'll save, we'll be fine. We're using both guns, hand cannon, Chicago sweeper. We're all stocked up, we're all ready to go. So that's save number three in the bag. I thought the typewriter was over here, but it's not. Right, there's a red herb. Grab that. Skip. First thing we're gonna do is climb up the ladder. We're gonna indestructible knife so we can do knife parries. But just deal some damage. Parry. We do hand cannon stuff. Dodge. Everything's completely avoidable. Easy. All right, because of the distance, we'll use the Chicago Sweeper a little bit, but I'll show you how to dodge all this stuff. When he picks them up one, one at a time, that's when you run sideways. One, one, run sideways. One, one, run sideways. They should be able to get through this without being hit at all. One and one. Sideways. Two. Stay still, duck. So if he picks them up at the same time, just stay still and duck. Got any barrels, man? If he does that, just jump. I think we're done. Yay! There we go. How easy was that? Alright, grab his eyeball. And we're gonna keep going. We've, we've got like another uh, half hour, I think. Maybe to an hour. We'll see. Do have to get ready. But we'll be fine. We're gonna get through this. So we're at three saves and we're approaching the castle. It's pretty good. Pretty good. One of those saves was unrelated to actually needing to save. First save I recommend before fish. Second save before Mendez. Not because he's difficult. Like I said, you could have skipped that save, right? That wasn't hard. That wasn't a challenge. But you never know. You may stuff up a run. You may get hit by a board. Accidents happen. Because we have so many saves, why risk it? Sell that. Kitchen knife we don't need. Alright, we're not gonna be able to forward much from there. It's gonna be expensive. Better to be. Don't get yourself killed now. <laughs> we're at the cannon section. There are medallions here. You can do them. But we might do some. You want some freebie items? Jump this. You don't have to jump it, but just shoot these guys. They die in one here. You might get gold, you might get gunpowder. It's free real estate, baby. A couple of shots. Come on, big head man. I hate those things. If I'm likely to die in this game, it's from those things. Nothing but money, I'll take it. Is this a red herb? Hell yeah. All right, just run. These archers aren't gonna shoot you. I mean, they might if you take it slow, but we're just gonna rush past them. They don't seem ready for it. 
You took a good shot there, lady. Straight to the shoulder. I'm down in one. Up six. If you want to know where they all are. Follow my guide. We'll, we'll get some. If I see him, we'll shoot him. That's the deal I'll make. Alright, run. Wait for this. And then you can go. Otherwise, I'll hit you. Out of my way, lady. Alright, there's a guy that will come behind us now we reach the stairs. So we'll deal with this guy. Then we'll turn around and deal with that guy. He's been chasing us for days. He finally caught up just to die. Alright, wait for the catapult and we'll cruise through. Out of my way. There's some fire barrels you can shoot. You can see him. There's also a guy here that's going to transform. So we'll deal with that guy first. Oh, right. In the mace. Alright, I always stuff this up. I always forget where they are. Where are the barrels? There's one. Yeah, no big deal. You can just throw a grenade as well if you really want to. I will. <laughs> I'm lazy. Ah, there you are. I knew there was another one you could see. Alright, there's one more medallion over here. I can't remember where the last one is. So, that'll be the end of our medallion run. I think if you look over the edge, maybe? I can't remember. I don't really care. It's not important. We're not, it's not going to help us. There's nothing that we're going to get out of doing that. That's going to make our life better here. So we're going to keep cruising through. It's open. Go. Uh, okay. Oh, you feel that one, buddy? Took it like a champ, i got to say. And then there was one. I don't remember where it is. <laughs> it's, it's somewhere. Look it up. Again, you don't need it. Don't, don't, don't bother getting it. We are very well stocked. So, because we have so many flash grenades, I want to show you a little trick that we're about to encounter to deal with the dungeon. It's made my life a thousand times easier. We're going to flash grenade the guy in the dungeon and then just open the wheel. We're not even going to fight him because I hate fighting them. I don't know why I suck at it. Look at this place. Welcome. I got something new for you. So we're saving all our big gems and stuff for sale well later. Well, we get some good stuff to combo. But for now... Come back that's all we need. We'll skip this cutscene. Deal with these goons. There's one coming behind us. So we better deal with that guy first. Now we run down. We'll get some distance. You can use the Chicago Sweeper here or the Hand Cannon. They're both. Just as good. Alright, we are done, right? Alright, there's some stuff to the side here. A little treasure. I think we have a small key. We haven't really been focusing them. We got two. Over here. Okay. Other thing to note in this area is there's a yellow herb, so we'll go grab that while Ashley's doing this. You to open it from the other side. These other treasures we're not gonna bother with. It's open. Thanks. Now take you and you and you. Alright, in this area there's a red herb. We don't want to miss that. Looks like we can continue on this way. Then, we do have a lot, so if you do miss it, 
Who cares? You're stuck, baby. You are stocked up. So we'll grab this, and now we're gonna do a little flash grenade trick. It's not a cheat. It's not a glitch. It's legit. Even though I think he's blind, but his parasite's not a thing. When we get to here, we're gonna lob this backwards. Now we're gonna run and open the gate and just leave. That's it. We don't have to fight him. See? We're <laughs> free, baby. How quick was that? That's crazy. Now if you want, you can go take Ashley down there and be like, here's that animal. Alright, I reckon we can get through the next areas. Then you okay? I have to go. But I will be back, like, immediately. To you, it'll be immediate. But I want to get through as much of this next area as we can. Right, easy puzzle. Shoot that one. Shoot snake. Shoot the bird. Ta-da! So quick. Again, another easy puzzle. Not much to freak out about here. I don't think people got stuck on this one. I think this one is pretty straightforward. Guy's getting stabbed. Bloody sword. We're gonna take this iron sword. Take it to his first form. Place that in there. Take the golden sword. It's fresh. Place it in there. And then the rusty sword on his grave. Because he's a nobody now. He has forgotten history. Except for these wall panels. There's a snake. So shoot this one multiple times. You get a free snake. It's also dead, so it's not much use to you. Unless you want a belt. A gold bangle, how beautiful. All right, we're gonna not jump this yet. We're gonna shoot this. I'm away, iron lady. Swing. And a jump. Don't even think about trying this yourself. And we're done. All right, this room, this next room sucks. I hate this room. Not because it's difficult, just because it's slow. I don't know how to do this room quickly. We're gonna do it quickly, but it's just, it just never feels quick enough. You know what I mean? I don't think there's any goodies in this room, is there? No. Garbage. Nothing. If you want to save here, I don't care. You do that. That's fine. I get it. I don't think you're going to die in this room. Especially when you've got this much health. But you might. I don't know. Accidents happen. No one expects to die. Alright, I'm going to try going to the left side this time. The actual like way that we have to go. There's a red herb to the right, but we, we might get it on the way out. It's the arches that give me the shits here. Everything else is easy breezy beautiful. But these damn arches annoy the crap out of me. Maybe I should buy a rifle before I come to this part. I don't know. I always get shot by them. Because you want to you deal with them, but then there's always dudes walking up towards you and it's just like, dude, give me, give me some slack, give me a break. Oh yeah, I forgot about those ones. I was just talking about archers and I forgot these nerds up here. Come on. Really? Alright, now we're surrounded by them. That's annoying. Just die, buddy. Just die. Give it up. Don't make me Chicago, you buddy. It takes twice as long. God damn it. <laughs> I hate these guys. You better be dead. If you get up, I'll be mad. Alright, slow and steady, slow and steady. There we go. Come on, crossbow lady. 
All right, last one. For now, there's two above me, but that'll be easier to kill. All right, some of these guys are going to transform to the big freaks. So we don't want to jump down there right now. Because these big freaks, they can withstand hand cannon shots for a little bit. They got their mouths closed. They just seem like damage reduction through the roof. There's an explosive barrel somewhere behind here, so just start spraying. You might hit it. There we go. Alright. I guarantee a couple of these big boys are transformed. So, we have to be careful here. Don't do it. I know you're going to. Ass. Ass, man. I'll sweep you guys under the rug. See, he withstands a hand cannon shot. Bonkers. Should've melted into goop. Come on, guys. <laughs> Please die. Please die. I don't wanna get eaten. There we go. Dickhead. Okay, okay, okay. Making good progress. I don't think those archers can see us. I'm gonna keep calling them archers even though they got crossbows. Okay, so we've got a couple more crossbows to deal with. Hey, they can shoot. They're shooting at me. So as soon as you put this wheel on, one's going to come to your left. So don't spin it or they'll shoot you. Shoot them first. Give me a break already. And then a guy with a shield will come as well. So you watch your back. So the quicker you get this down, the less people are going to come from that side because they're, they're going to come from this in front of us instead because it's quicker. So it's just this guy that we got to deal with. Oh, that looked good. To me, that looked good. Felt good. As long as he doesn't get up and be a freak and eat our faces. All right. Crossbows will annoy us again. That's what they do. Like that. Don't shoot me, lady. Oh, what are you doing up there? I thought you were dealt with. Oh, at least these are the easy ones. It's the big crab ones, things that we hate. Come on, lady. I ain't got time for you. Yeah, oh, what the shit? <laughs> Get out of here. God damn it. Okay. Okay. Let's deal with these. See you raising that. You don't try and shoot me. Ah, fuck now. I'm trying to watch both sides, man. And then there was one. You're all by your lonesome. Now we can do this wheel without worrying about getting shot from all angles. It's annoying. This next section is easy. So like I said, that section is not difficult. It's just a pain. We're not out of the, woods yet. the threat of you dying is really only against those big headed crab things who are getting caught by surprise. The archers are just annoying. If you want to buy a bigger gun that has like a, a scope or something, go ahead. It may save you time. That's the main thing that holds us up, is trying to shoot the archers and avoid getting hit by the arrows. The last thing I want to do is get Killed by a goddamn crossbowman. Little over the top, don't you think? All right, up you go, little lady. 
We'll get on our hand cannon, we'll deal with this. You're gonna be okay? Yeah, I, I, I got this. I wanna say threat level midnight here. It's nothing. Non existent. It's garbage. There is no threat. Here they come. Didn't get the guy I was aiming at. <laughs> they killed his friend. Be careful. Hey, 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 hey. Come the shieldy boys. There we go. I think you're clear for now, lady. Give me one second. Don't go running. The closer you guys are, the easier it actually is for me, so please do rush me. Alright. Now pick her up, buddy. She's heavy, she'll hurt your back. It's a lot of iron. Just let her spin the goddamn wheel. Grab all our gold. She stayed in your little doorways, peeps. Okay, get back here. Alright, you ready? Let's go. See what's inside these pots. Nothing good. Nothing good. Good to know. Come on. That's that area done. It's slow. It's a bit snoozy. But you gotta do it. Read the next chapter already. Flying through this, man. Okay. This has been fun. This is enjoyable. I think we're like at the halfway point, right? <laughs> I'm sorry, I was just checking if you're in this, but I didn't mean to shoot you in the throat there. All right, Skippy Skippy. Are we gonna say no? Let's go pay the merchant a visit. Sell some of our stuff, cause we're stocked up. We got too many goods. I'm tempted to buy a bigger case if he has one. I know there's, I think there's a bigger one. I don't know, hold out or not. It's all yours, man. It's all yours. Ah, I'll buy it at a high price. Body armor? So it doesn't have a case yet. That's okay. <laughs> you can't go wrong with that. <laughs> Good really the only things we need to buy. We might buy the mask and stuff later. What can I do you for? Okay, come back. Thank you very much. All right, this next area is pretty easy. There's not much threat of dying. We're going to be a-okay. Just trust me. So the first thing you're going to want to do is when we jump down here, is take aim at Big Red. Gun him down. Should be two shots. So slow and steady. You can use the sweeper here as well if you want. Done. Now we don't have to deal with them transforming. And we can just sit here in this doorway, shooting. Zero threat. Nothing to worry about. Just let them come. It's the only way in, and they're just gonna funnel through like morons. Okay. There's two crossbow ladies in this room. We will deal with them. 
But all we really gotta do is grab that lantern and a treasure. And we'll call that a success. Ooh, good shot, good shot. Get the hell out of here. And your little friend. That looks pretty close. Right, we got the Crimson Lantern. Got some cashola. We got a mirror with pearls. How beautiful. Nothing good. Don't want it. Don't care for it. Let's get the hell out of here. Bust this. Alright, that's that room done. Is that easy or what? Entering the next puzzle room. Last person I thought I'd run to here. Grab a velvet blue. Ah, oh, blue velvet. That's what I reckon that movie was called. We got a key. Brass pocket watch. Beautiful, lovely thing. Great. Don't forget this chest. That's actually better. That's way better than what we spend the key on. Alright, we got all the little boards. Now there's faint markings on show you the solution, so we know this one is the sword over here. Put that down there. That one there. And then that means this one up top, we just flip it over. Ta-da! Puzzles, baby. That should do all the clues are there. Funny thing is, a lot of the um, comments you get on, on doing guides for puzzles like that, people are like, how did you guess that? I didn't guess it. <laughs> it's clues. It's a puzzle. Not just random. They don't just expect you to randomly work it out. They have like, here's a piece that has the answers. And then, oh, maybe I'll look at the faint markers. Oh, there, of course. Okay, I can tell the shape. You got way closer than I thought you were going to. Really see upping this Chicago sweeper. We've been focusing the hand cannon. But the hand cannon's almost done. Alright! This part's alright. I like this part. I've got something new for you, mate. It's all yours, my man. Well <laughs> we need some more Let's money. And we'll get that. Alright, there's some little tricks we're going to pull off to get through this. They're not cheats, they're not glitches, they're just the speedy way to get through this. So, we'll go through these guys just to make our life a little bit easier. We have the ammo. You can literally run past these guys. If you watch my five hour play, there's so many skips where it's just like the enemies are too slow to react that you can just run past them. I want to deal with these spiders, I don't normally, but I get sick of the time pressure of having them coming towards me while I'm trying to do this next part, so I get rid of them. Go away, spiders. Go away. I know I'm Australian, but I'm sick of spiders. Alright, run to this edge and just like shoot here-ish and you'll hit the chain. There we go. With a more precise gun, it's much easier. But we've got infinite ammo. We can just spam like crazy there. I'll deal with these guys before I go in there. Oh, oh, two for one. How nice. Shield didn't protect you from that, did it? And my favorite ladies in the game. Okay, so now, if you've got a grenade, I hope you do. If you don't, go buy one. We have heaps, because we haven't used them. Now, you could shoot this guy if you want. If you're feeling optimistic, you could try and hand cannon him to death. Out of my way. You too, why not? 
All right, that's a little bit slower than I like. Crossbow, ladies. Oh, what the shit? <laughs> oh, that's not good. No. <laughs> I've ne- well, come on. Okay, come on. Give me a chance here. I've never been bowled over by a crossbow. That was a hell of a shot, lady. You mean the leg or something? Okay, hopefully that doesn't happen to you. That's never happened to me. Honest, lady. It's never happened. I usually perform well all the time. Slay throws an axe. It may hit you. There we go. You can laugh now. I told you. I called it. I knew it was coming. Better that she hit me there than when I'm climbing up the ladder like she often does. She a real bitch, that lady. I don't like her. She deserved what had come. My advice usually would be wait behind that barrier before shooting. Adios. But that axe sort of annoyed me, so we rushed it. All right. Open the trap. All right, let's test my accuracy here. Not bad, not bad. He's still kicking. Oh, you're not kicking. In fact, I would advise you against trying to kick. Next. We're done. We're gonna cruise into the maze section now. Sorry, I've had my fill of you guys. Ashley, where are you? She's just sleeping in here, apparently. And then she locked the door from the outside. How dare she. Chicken man here. Chicken delivery. Anyone want to fry chicken? I have plenty for all. All right, let's do this maze. This is going to be easy. All right, my goal is, because we're on a time limit here, we're gonna get this maze done. We're gonna get the inside of the main hall done up until Ashley's section and we'll save before Ashley. Not because the Ashley part is difficult. It's literally, you're invincible. It's gonna be easy. But I think I think that's where we're gonna head it up to for now. And then like, I don't know why I'm telling this because like to you, you won't even know that I've gone through the power of editing. It'll be as if I was here the entire time. Doggy, kapow. All right, Chicago Sweeper is better here than the hand cannon for dealing with the dogs in the cage. Cause if you try to use the hand cannon, it's inaccuracy and the speed of the dogs sucks. So we will use the hand cannon for some, but we'll Chicago sweep for others. So these ones, go to town, baby. You don't want to be trying to cap him with a hand cannon. Trust me. You can try, I don't care. I'm not, I can't stop you, but it's just much easier. These guys, on the other hand, one shot. Wait for this one to climb. It's just easier to shoot him. And then he goes flying. Where he ends up, I have no idea. We're going to get a fancy chessboard. An elegant chessboard. I would love a fancy chessboard like that. If you find this video helpful, send me a fancy chessboard. All right, that's two flags, chicken man. Let's get bucking. Get ready for this dog. Dunzo. Again, Chicago sweep the floor with these mows. Make life much easier. There we go. Get out of here, doggy. God, he just keeps kicking, doesn't he? I don't know what this dog's problem is. He's just kind of watching. I don't think he wants to be involved. But by doing nothing, it's like being involved. So he had that coming.
Oh, it's so good for dealing with dogs. All right, there we go. Now, this section, when these guys come, don't just jump down and run to the door. You will fail. Ashley will get kidnapped because you've abandoned her. If the little icon of Leon and Ashley is not in the bottom right corner, she is not considered to be with you. If you run out that door, she's not going to be with you. You have to wait until the game agrees that, yeah, she's going to be okay. Doesn't care if she's in armor or not. You've abandoned her. You're a jerk. So right now, no symbol. She's not with us. If I left the area, I'd fail. We don't have to kill these guys. We could just shoot in the general area. They're just slowing her down. She's gonna reach us. But you can see there's no symbol yet, so she's not with us. So if I had left, if I had just kept running and opened that door, the game would be like, what the hell? You don't want you don't want to take Ashley? That's your priority number one. Is to take Ashley. You abandon her. Now she's with us! There we go. We can leave! But I would have doubled. Okay. I'm gonna double down. Make sure. So if you rush that and you're like, "Oh my god, what the hell? This game's bullcrap. It glitched out. Was this a bug?" Nah, you just didn't pay attention. Must be this way. All right, let's do this area, and then we're gonna save. I have something up well. Not again. Oh, not because I think it's difficult. Yet. Just because I have to. It's good to take a break as well, I guess. So he has a new case, but we're not going to do it. Excuse me, good lady. I upgraded the hand cannon because I considered for a moment of using the Chicago Sweeper in this next section. We're doing the more difficult section. Of course, you can save if you're concerned about fighting these knights. I thought about using the Chicago Sweeper, but then I remembered, no, the hand cannon is actually much better because... You can just kind of shoot their armor and it will kill them. You don't have to actually hit them in the face or the neck and stuff. So, we're good. We're good. We're pretty happy here. Let's do this. Bring it on, nighty knights. If you do hit him in the neck, it's pretty much a one hit kill on him. At least that doesn't kill you. <laughs> Keep it coming. Keep... You know which ones are coming because the, the torches on their thing goes out. See, we can just shoot their armor. We don't have to stress about hitting them in the sweet spot. That's pretty cool. Let's go, buddy. Oh, this guy's going down. This guy's going down straight away. Yeah. Up the hit to the neck, man. And then there were two. Easy. Hand cannon is so good for the section. If you stagger towards me. Big fella! Accuracy does not matter. We're done. Section done. Come on down. Yeah. Nighty night, knights. Oh yeah, these guys get the good stuff. You can take all of these. Look at that. Stocked up, baby. So if you have anything you want from the uh, trade section. All right, the cube is here. We don't really need it because we're not going after the golden egg. So this is not necessary. We might open a couple of chests if we see him. But, again, not necessary. We're only doing it for money now. So that's that area done. We're going to cruise up to the left here and do this dining hall puzzle. It's not a very difficult puzzle. There's a painting down the end that shows the place settings that you need them to sit at. And then you just go and sit in those place settings and ring the bell. That was the whole puzzle. I'm not going to ask how long that took you, because I hope. Looks like we figured it out. 
not too long. The longest part is looking at each setting and being like, is this the one? No. Just kind of pick a few items from the painting and be like, that's what we're going for. Make a good time. I'm happy. I feel like we're close to the end, like, definitely halfway. Flash grenade. Stops the guy from pulling the thing. If he pulls it, who cares? You've got a gun with unlimited ammo. It's not the end of the world if you end up down there. We'll try and do this section a little bit quicker than usual. So, by grabbing this, and then turning around and running a little bit, some goons will come. We'll take care of them. Some of these goons are the ones from down below. So we'll just wait for them. Have a good. Who cares about that guy? Transform. I don't care, man. I'm leaving. Ashley, keep up. No problem. All right, I gotta go for now, but it'll be a split second for you. I don't know when I'll be back. I'm gonna go have a good time, swimming lessons. 16 months to three years old. She's moving up in the world, my little girl. Let's save it. And I'll see you in a second. Movie magic, baby. It's like I never left. All right. We're doing the Ashley section. This section is easy because we're invincible. It's pretty straightforward without the armor. You may have mild hesitation when doing it without the armor because it's a little bit freaky and one hit kill. But once you know the pathing, it's not too bad. The only main section that's scary is the part where you've got to ring all the little bell things, knock all the little chimes. That part can be like unpredictable in the pathing of the enemies. You might be like, oh, they're gonna get me when well, I went the wrong way. So I get it. But for us, this is just how quick can we do this without Taking too long. We don't want to take too long. Seven o'clock, baby. Just dial it back, and it's seven o'clock. Boom. Easy. Never changes. Always the same. In hardcore professional, it's seven o'clock. I think in standard, it's 11.04. I think. Something like that. But we're not doing standard. In fact, I don't know if we'll ever play standard again. All I've been doing is playing professional. That's what I'm used to now. In the elevator we go. Those guys behind us are no threat. In fact, I don't think they're ever a threat. I think they're just there to scare you, to make you be like, ah, I'm going to die, this is so stressful. But it's not too bad. All right, we can ring these in any order. We don't have to worry about getting hit, because we cannot go down. Excuse me, excuse me. Nice chopping. Ashley will tug this one off. And then she'll tug this one off. And all the knights are happy now. Oh, it's tempting to come back and kill that guy. Nah, nah, I got me bothered. Let's uh, see what time we get. We're making a good time. We're not rushing anything. We're not skipping anything. We're just kind of going at a good pace. We're at just over two hours now. That's not bad. For a little fun playthrough of Professional. Is there such a thing? Yes, this is it. 
All right, we'll grab this and the torches go out. Oh my God. Try to think when our next save will be. The mine carts. I think the mine carts maybe. That's a while away. I guess we'll see. I don't think. I think I'm, I think I'm in the clear for a little bit here. I think I'm good. Until uh, baby bedtime. We got, a, we got like an, maybe an hour, hour and a half maybe. So we should be able to get through a whole chunk here. Excuse me, good sir. Just run. There's camera control. Beautiful. Smooth. Whoosh. Whoosh. Satisfying, right? Cinematic, baby. Excuse me, coming through. Don't mind me. Alright, that's the Ashley section done. It always feels like it's a long one. Whenever I get to this part, I'm always like, oh, I gotta do this. Because there's no, no threat, there's nothing like, I don't know. It's a weird section when you've got the armor on. It's almost like pointless, like it just feels time consuming. There's a dread of having to do it. Hopefully we don't die and have to do it again. That would suck. But I'm guessing if this is this is in the video, we, we make it, man. We make it. We're gonna make it. I forgot to do the cube thing when we saved just before, so I'm gonna do that now. Little tip with these cubes. Pick a, pick a thing, so like, see the square on the side? There we go, I got the square, so I just know how to rotate it. Yeah, ta-da! Is that another butterfly land? How beautiful. All right, what do we need? We're not selling anything? Knife? All right, we don't have much money. Does have a bigger case. I don't think that's the biggest case. If he keeps it for a while, I might buy it. See how full my inventory gets with these healing items. Run to the bugs. Bug time. Hand cannon's pretty good. I'm not sure. I remember the sweeper being all right. But we haven't really upgraded this too far. I can't remember if you focus the sweeper, if you have it. I don't think, I think you have it almost max at this point. Almost. All right, there's a first aid spray in here. If you're desperate, hopefully you're not. Hopefully you're looking similar to myself. All right, bug room. Here we go. You can pick off some from a distance. So if you see him, you can bop him. Wow, Ramona, you are really slacking on your but the most frustrating thing here is having these guys kind of swarm you. The hand cannon is a one hit kill, but it can be a bit tricky if you're kind of surrounded. Trying to get in position there. So like, once you clear out an area, you might clear some off the wall and stuff. New ones will come and set up so like even though they might not be hidden in this spot at the moment they do hey come on man that's talking they do come and not replace them not like take the same positions but like there's no monster here at the moment but one will come later and camouflage itself there so the ones that come and attack you don't just come and attack you they actually like take up position to surprise you in areas that you've already passed through Hopefully none jump on us. I'll try and remember where they all are. So we should see a couple here. Bop. 
There we go. And then they're flying in. Go away, bugs. Go away. Shoot, bugs. Don't bother me. So yeah, I like to do the staircase first and then the ladder because then from the ladder you can just kind of jump down in front of the door. Preference. You can do it either way you want. Oh, oh big stack. Oh, and a velvet blue. That's good. All right, let him come, let him come. Come on, bug boy. I thought he was gonna get me there. All right, couple jump down. Actually, there's a treasure over there. We should get that. Hey, 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 don't mind me, don't, don't hit me, don't hit me. Good crowd control. All right, let's get that treasure. Go away. See this guy? See him to my right? Yeah, he's a new one. We'll pick him up from the top. So he come up just now. He wasn't there before. Sneaky. I think another one comes. Or maybe that was him. That might just be him. There we go. Look at him. Thought you were so cool. Okay, my most hated room. I don't know why I'm so crap at this. <laughs> these, these, this is why we skip the other guy. These guys annoy me. In standard, you can kind of like sneak up and knife him in the back, but in this one, there's no break in here. If you're going in here, you're going in here. The door is locked, you gotta fight your way out. The first, that one's okay. It's the armored one that's a pain. This one you can kind of kill just by shooting him a lot. Or if you can shoot him in the back, obviously. But I'm not sure if they uh, have to be shot in the back. It's all the metal that annoys me. Like, get a couple of freebie shots while he's flashed. But yeah, that big guy, he's a pain in my butt, man. He's annoying. You're annoying too, dude. Get out of my way. Thanks, man. Thanks, ass. Lucky we are stocked up. There are bells you can ring as well. If you want. If we get a chance. Oh, just gotta, I just gotta land that shot. That's happy days. Back up, back up. Not to mention all the dudes that keep dropping in. You guys are annoying. You gotta kind of try and use them as bait. It's tricky. Come on, big fella. Come on, big fella. We're just lucky they don't have like a one-hit kill or something. That would be annoying. Look at this guy. Look at this jingly mode. Hey, 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 hey! Maybe go for the guy making noise, man. Not me. Dickhead. See what I mean? Annoying. God damn. Annoying. All right, come on. This gotta end you. This gotta end you. Still kicking. Kill each other. Fight each other. You don't know each other. Maybe we had time to bond, I guess. Come on. Come on. That's gotta be it. That's gotta be it. There we go. God damn. Alright, now it's just the armored one. If you know a shortcut <laughs> or a trick to killing these guys, do that. And then tell me it. 
So next time I play through professional, I don't have to do this dumb room. Sucked in! If he wasn't armored, buddy, he's lucky I didn't, you didn't mace me, that would have annoyed me. If he wasn't armored, I'd just keep shooting. Here we go. Here we go, this feels good. This feels pretty good. Damn. Alright, alright, alright. Settle down, settle down. I don't want to swap to the sweeper. I want, I want to do this. I'm committed now. Like ding a bell or something. Oh, 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 hey. I was going to hit the bell. I'll oh, get stuff. Imagine if I died to that instead. Okay, we're done. We did the room. We didn't get hit a lot, which is nice. It's more just... There's no quick way that I'm aware of to murder those guys in professional. They just take your time. We're going to the depths. Doesn't that sound exciting? If you got good accuracy, this area is not too bad. It's, it's the bugs aren't too threatening. I'll probably miss some shots. They always set me up the wrong way. All right, squeeze through here. So you'll see eyes glowing. Shoot them. Hand cannon. Is one shot. You could use the sweeper if you want. Talk about sticking the landing. I mean, who beats up a guy with a chicken hat? Sometimes you can get this one. The hell? So close. Probably. I don't know. Who knows where that shot went? That's <laughs> a wild one. All right, there's Mr. Glow Glow. You're also able to spot them by the ripples in the water. You'll see like little waves as they move. They cause the water to wave. Out of my way, chump. You can also sometimes get this one. What? Come on. I thought he screamed because I got him. All right, you're supposed to go to the left. I'll go get that. Good shot. Numbnuts. Don't have any yellows. Now oh, we're about to get a yellow. Uh, I probably could have held out. I've disorientated myself by going to the left. Now I'm lost. <laughs> We're back where we are. Die, man. We came down the stairs, and then we should have gone this way. No, wait. That's right, isn't it? Oh, man. Oh, man. What the hell? Okay. <laughs> I never go right. When you come down the stairs, I never go right. That completely threw me off. Because I went to pick up the money. Greed. Greed got the better of me. No, I just got one more guy to kill, right? It doesn't kill me. Alright, well, I guess... Oh, I was going to say we could use our yellow hair, but we could eat a fish. Tasty treat from the sea. All right, there's a yellow herb in this room. Don't forget it. Because if you do, you can't use it. Oh, we got this boss fight. Oh yeah, this one, Chicago Sweeper all the way. This is the fight that I highly, 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 highly recommend using Chicago Sweeper. A hand cannon. I don't know why, but it's just not good enough. Chicago Sweeper will get us through this. The hand cannon, because he's so 
dodgy. He's hard to land a hit. Yeah, he's frozen and stuff, but you want to you want to do some fast firing. And once he's unfrozen, the Chicago sweeper can kind of keep him stunned. Where the hand cannon? Nah. So we're going we're going full Chicago sweeper. It's tempting. I don't always have this in stock, stranger. I do need that. That's that's more important. We'll also probably use some flash grenades if we're desperate. Let's see how it goes. So we're gonna cruise through. We do two dodges. And then we come back out. May grab, grab the first aid and treasure. And then finish the fight. That's the plan. I know you haven't saved in a while. So if you wanted to save before this, you should have done it. <laughs> I would have done it. But you're watching this before you play a section, right? So my advice is say before this section, if you're uncomfortable with the idea of doing this section and dying. You have heaps of saves as well, by the way. So you'll be fine. All right, that's the two we got to dodge. There's a green herb just here. I failed to grab. I'll grab it on the way back. So, we just do a little loop, and he'll jump down. Ta-da! Wait for him. Bullet. Alright. Sweeper time! Go for the face. You can kick him down if you want as well. But I'm just gonna shoot him in the face a whole bunch. He's gone. All right, he runs away. So we're playing hide and seek. Now we gotta wait for him to come back. And we'd kill him again. This is the part where it gets tricky because we're kind of out of the open now. There's no scripted escape. So that escape after a certain amount of damage, he disappears. Now he could beat the crap out of us until we die. But that's not gonna happen, don't worry. Don't worry. I know that sounded scary, but it's gonna be okay. Should be another attack here. We're gonna grab the goodies and then we're gonna get out of here. Maybe we'll do some more crafting. Some flashbangs, flash grenades. We have a lot. They're very useful. Too slow, Mo. All right, now we should hopefully rock up soon. I'm gonna go stand by this. Oh, that's the <laughs> wrong way. Okay, is he here? Yes, he's here. I went the wrong way, man, let me pass. All right, we'll go the other one. We'll go the other way. We're meant to go down here. Dummy. Here he comes. Hey, that's a big jump, man. That was unexpected. I thought you were going to walk. Let me use one of the yellow so we get more health. There we go. Die, 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 die. So he might run away here. And we're going to carry on down. To the next freezing section. That's where we're gonna finish him up. So we're gonna run down here and he should come out the other end. So he won't come out. Hang on, buddy. He won't come that way. He'll actually come behind us. So just listen. Oh, yeah. Okay, he's here already. Now we finish him. So we're gonna use this corner as an advantage against him. Just to kind of keep him locked in place and just aim for his face. Don't worry. Just stay here. Just keep him locked down. This is why I tell you the sweeper is better. Get the hell off me, man. 
All right. Time to die, buddy. So we'll use this corner. It's like a little defense, so he shouldn't be able to do a jump like that again. Because he thinks we're hiding. He considers us hiding from him. And he should die. Any second. Come on, buddy. Give it up. Hey, Macarena. All right. We'll take that gold monocle. Beautiful. We're well stocked. Very well stocked. Probably should buy that bigger case. Alright, what comes next? What are we doing next? Where... I don't remember. Lewis? Yeah, 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 yeah. The dynamite part. Okay, buck, 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 chicken man, let's go. Quick cup of tea break. <clears throat> Delicious. Why help me though? What's in it for you? <laughs> you All right, you got a case for me, man. You got something good. You can have that. Small resources, ammo. I do not need armor. 90,000, hey? Better to be over prepared. Am I right? <laughs> you can't go wrong with that. Where would it come back? Any I know he gets a bigger case. Because we need to save so much money, I don't know if I should spend the money on that case now. It's, like, it's not that it's not that we're desperate for resources, you know. I don't want that. Um, it's just like when we pick up stuff, like I don't know, would it pay itself off? Like if I took a bigger case, all the ammo and stuff I sold would it pay for itself? I just want to feel good about myself. I don't know. I don't think so. All right, this is a hand cannon section if I've ever seen one. Let's get hand cannon happy. Looks like we've got company. What do you want Receive to do? ammo. I'll take some ammo, man. You really I'll think I need ammo? Oh, that's a tricky shot. Can he do it? Don't tell me he's transforming. Oh, dynamited. Should have waited just a little more. I think I can get him. Try one more. That looked pretty good to me. I was I was excited for that one. I thought that was gonna be an impressive shot. All right, Mr. Chainsaw. Now the thing is, we haven't actually been spotted yet, so they're not really rushing us. The hand cannon kills don't really trigger getting spotted. It's like a I don't know. It's like a silencer. Buddy, you just walk around with one arm. Lewis, come on, we've been through this at the cabin. All right, he's gonna spawn me. Yeah, now he's calling everybody. We almost stealthed that whole section. That would've been amazing. All right, he's done for, how easy. Molotov man, take out your buddies. The main threat here is dynamite, dudes. Don't wanna get dynamite, there's a guy. Oh, buddy, 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 don't blow me up, don't blow me up. Dynamite can be a one-hit kill. Dynamite can just blow you to pieces if you're standing right on it when it goes off. Dynamite does scare me. Who has dynamite now? You. Little lady. Go away, buddy. Go away. Hey, hey, hey. Hey, hey. Chill, chill, chill. Buddy, buddy, buddy. Don't get my weight, man. Alright, she's down. She's out. Just big mama. Up in Big Mama's house here. We'll pick her off. Couple of shots to the back. Oh, come on. It's alright, I'll wait here. I'll be ready for you here. 
Too eager. Too eager. Slow it down. Slow it down, man. There we go. Done! Done, 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 done. There is a green herb over here. If you need it, we don't, but we're gonna take it anyway. This is so far is a pretty clean professional S plus run. There's a guy up here with dynamite, just wait here. Probably blow himself up. Another guy might come as well, so. You are running, running, running. Don't transform. Still blowing himself up. He's just not good with that dynamite. The least threatening dynamite guy in the entire game. He's an idiot. Two guys. Bob and Bill. And their friend Jeff. Jeff wanted no part of this. He wasn't feeling well, he had a stomach bug. Why do I keep picking? I might, I might buy that case. Okay, we're covered to a section where we're gonna fight two giants. If that scares you, find somewhere to save. Check your map. Run back to the merchant. Because I am fearless, we're gonna fight him. Then I gotta peace out for a minute again. Went so quick. Time went so quick. Didn't realize. It's getting close to 6:30 here. It's baby bedtime. I gotta say good night to her. Luckily, her mom's putting her down tonight, which means we get another hour to do some more goody action. So most of our saves are gonna be, like legit, most of our saves are just general life things. If you could, if you had the time, if you had like four hours to just sit and play this, you'd probably only save three times. Isn't that crazy? That's wild. Kill this guy. Take you no time at all. Pretty sure he's dead. Hey, hey, let me get this shot. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I wasn't ready for the roll. Just die, big fella. Just die. There we go. Had to get him in the face. Do a little bit of extra damage. You can actually hit this guy. You can dam You can hurt this guy by getting him in the face. Yeah, he's covered. Hey, 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 hey. I was reloading. I couldn't run. Wouldn't let me run. Um, he has a little space on his mask. You can actually kill him if you're feeling accurate. Right there. So if you can land some sweet hand cannon shots, you could kill him before ever needing dynamite. Isn't that crazy? I'm not good enough to do that though. Maybe if I had the gas mask on, I don't know. Come on, chunky monkey. Buddy, I'd love to get a chance to just shoot you a couple times. Terrible. <laughs> Terrible shooting. Alright, finally, man. Now I gotta lure him back over there. Oh, kick me. Kick a man just as a chicken. Come on, big fella. Feet are exposed, but it doesn't seem to count. Hey, hey, don't step on me. What reflexes would I need to be able to dodge a step on from a cutscene? Like, legit, man. Die. Die. Come on. There we go. That's the giant brothers dealt with. Flying through it. Uh, we got minecarts coming up. So we'll save. That's actually good timing. That's good timing. I'm only going to be gone for a little bit. But I have to save that. We we're going to save there anyway. So that kind of works out pretty well. Give me your gold. Your sweet, sweet gold. That's not gold. Open the door, Lewis. 
Usually you bust it open and it's like, hey, look, I opened it. Where the hell did he go? Keeping those things cooped up down here too. The underground here is Green herb? Oh. I mean we don't need this. Right, actually we don't really need a green herb either, but better than small resources when they're gonna use. Of course they did. Okay, so I say save here because this is a thing you don't really have control over. The only thing you control is your accuracy. And I'm playing on controller. If you're on PC, you might be alright, but I'm on controller. Bad things could happen. But you'll be fine. Who are you calling Sancho? Moving. Here we go, chappy chaps. I can't believe I'm doing this. Did you miss me? Did you notice I was gone? Doubt it. I doubt it, right? I got a little bit into this section, then I had to stop. I thought I could maybe get to the next one, but luckily we saved beforehand. I thought, I thought oh, it's okay. I know, I had to stop. Didn't even notice. See if I can do as well as I just did. Breeze this, untouched. I'm not. That's not. That's not a lie. That legit happened. That it is untouched. But then I had to pack it up. And I didn't want to leave this on pause because I don't know. I think pause. Actually, I don't know. Just pause. Count towards your timer. Who knows? Ha ha ha! Die! 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 See, look at this. See, I told you. I did it untouched. The whole thing. Both sides. Both tracks. No joke. We'll see how the next one goes. Next one's the tricky one. This one's... If you die in this one, something really went wrong. So you could always save at the next section. But again, I say, why risk it? It's only a couple minutes. Like, what if you miss these guys and they kill you? Or this guy? Could happen. Maybe you accidentally shoot a barrel and blow yourself up. I don't know. Maybe you missed this guy. Something could have happened, you could have died in this section. And that would suck. Blammo. Shoot the sign, and I think we're done, right? Now we just slowly cruise to the end. First section. Easy, baby. Easy. It's the second one with a chainsaw, man. I feel like the second one is de determined by how well your accuracy is in one section. If you can land one good shot, the whole thing is a breeze. Oh, I had a, I got, so I got past this part, the next section obviously. This guy in here with the dynamite. This, it was the cleanest shot I've ever seen. It was like this little gap, took out both of them. The other guy had run up here, and it was a double kill, beautiful. You'll never see it. Another herb. I'll take it. We are so well stocked up. Money. No, last time I got 600 bucks. Hey, I got 600 again. Memory. Ready to go, buddy? Let's go. Alright, so this is the one that I feel like you might be worried about. You might be concerned about. Since the chicken hat doesn't really protect your car, you could put the gas mask on. I found the gas mask to do nothing. But then, someone told me that you have to turn aim assist on in the settings. 
So maybe it does do something, but I didn't, whatever it does, I didn't notice it. All right, let's get to it. Get a couple shots. And then we gotta get real baddies. These are the ones who are gonna damage you. You're a bit slow. All right, slow it down, slow it down. Oh, we might get hit here. Oh, I tried to destroy his cart. That's okay. Better be the one and only shot you get. Actually, we did a clean no hit ride in our previous professional play. So if you want to see that, watch that, because already it's gone better than this has. All right, this is the air. Get ready, shoot that. There we go. If you do that, Chainsaw Man, Dr. Salvador, his minecart will come out heavily damaged and it will take a couple of shots to destroy him. And then it will just be these awkward, quiet moments where he's not around. So here he comes. Look at his cart. He's gone. <laughs> That's it. Oh, it's easy. So make sure you land that shot. Now, now you can get shot, I guess, if you want to. If you feel like getting hit, get hit. Otherwise, now we've got these awkward parts where it's just like quiet. It's just nice and peaceful. I'm gonna go for some cart destruction as well here, just because I can. We've got we've got the health for it. To die seems unlikely now. <laughs> that well, mine carts. See what I mean? Awkward silence. And then I think we're done with this. That's it, right? I don't think we shoot any more baddies. So you see what I mean? If you can land that shot, you've got room to get hit by the uh, crossbow guys. I don't think they're gonna kill you. But if you don't take him out, that's where the threat comes from. So that's, the minecart section is not difficult if you can make one really good shot outside. All right, bug time, baby. Bopping these, I believe, reduces the bugs. It's a theory I'm developing. I have no proof. I just feel like it goes better when I do destroy these. Hey, hey, I was trying to see if I could see all the bugs and pick them all off now. It's okay. It's okay. We'll get moving. Don't hit me. Don't hit me. Okay, he's gonna hit me. Now we're good. <laughs> All right, let's stop mucking around. Should we get to business? You guys happy? There's a merchant in this area as well, which is nice, because we're about to fight Krauser for the first time. Biggest tip I can give you, be aggressive. Be, be aggressive. That one never attacks us, but I kill him anyway. Maybe he does attack us. I don't know. Not he doesn't jump us. Ah, oh, there's a yellow herb. I could have I could have waited. Or would I be dead now if I waited? I don't know. All right, I always get jumped here. There's one I always forget. Let's see if I can remember which one. Was it you? Maybe. No, it's you. God damn it. <laughs> I thought I could outrun him. Die. Jerk. Uh, there's a treasure. We're going to grab a treasure. I'm going to bump this barrel. If I get jumped in the back, I'm going to be mad, Lewis. You have a gun, don't you, buddy? Jackass. He is no help, honestly. This entire run, he has been a pain in my butt. He has not helped me.
If I can't carry it, I don't want it. Alright, there's a little dark section here. A gold bar. Tasty. Out of my way. Now, where was the last one? I have forgot. Oh, I can get that. I can get that. There we go. Bye-bye, bugs. All right, let's visit the merchant. We'll get our uh, body armor repaired. Maybe we'll buy that case. It's tempting. It's a lot of money. Because we're going to be buying another one anyway. got something new for you. Ruby's all rubbish. That's good work, if I do say so myself. Pleasant travels. Excuse me, good sir. All right, we're not going to save until the next Krauser fight. And then I'm going to bed. <laughs> well, not really bed. We gotta watch the Mandalorian. And then we're going to bed. Actually, no, that's a lie too. We're gonna watch Mandalorian and then watch Mad Men, and then go to bed. Are you being controlled by that cult? Let's go, buddy. I'm a free man. Captain Krauser. Just sounds better. Major, Just be aggressive. Just be super aggressive. Oh, oh get kicked in the face. Hurts, doesn't it? That was okay. Maybe I'm being a little too aggressive. Well, not aggressive enough! If I wasn't stabbing a box like an idiot, we might be done by now. It's getting close. I can feel it. I can feel it. Come on. There we go. That's so quick. If I landed some more of those knives, we would've been done quicker. All right, we're not saving. We're carrying through. We're going all the way to next Krauser fight. So our previous save was at the start of the minecarts. And we're burning right through this thing. Grabbing our green herb. Grabbing our red herb. There you are. We got a long way to go. Bark, bark, bark. Leon the chicken. Now the golden egg. You can go get it. If you want to. It'll make the Salazar boss fight easier. However. You have to go get it. How lazy are you? Tempting. But we're gonna be fine. That's how lazy I am. I'm so lazy, I'm gonna do it the proper way. The idea of going to get a golden egg Hang in there, Ashley. sounds worse than fighting him properly. And by properly, I mean with our infinite weapons. The game counts it. I was gonna say that. We get an S. Plus. Counts it. Clap, clap, clap. Don't slow clap me. Out of my way. 
chump. Settle down there, Captain Romania. Next. Oh! Better shot than you, lady. Alright, where's your little head of explosives? There we go. Who wants some? Come get some. Nighty night. Let's get crafting. Man, we have a lot of heals. If you ever played a Resident Evil game on the hardest difficulty and had this many heals, I want to pretend the answer is no. I was told that even with bonus weapons, professional is still the most difficult thing in Resident Evil. Not feeling that. I think we uh be on that now. All right, watch out for big balls. They're gonna be rolling down. Oh, here they come. I get in my way. Buddy, please. Hey, hey, hey. You really know how to make someone take your time, ball, take your time. Calm down, lady. Whoa, we got a twofer. Alright, little Miss Archer. As long as my crosshair is on her, it'll go through the bars. Oh! Alright, you, ball boy! Go back to the tennis! All right, there's a great trick to this next section. So usually a uh, wizard man appears. We can smush him. So if we hit this, we jump down and activate the elevator immediately. He'll spawn in, and he'll start running up these stairs. And mush, he's gone. No more transformations from him. Now we slowly ascend, pick up any arches that are going to annoy us. This is one of those things where I can never learn the, the pattern, where to look, where they're going to come from. I like to think I have a good memory, but not for this section. Maybe because I always chaotically spin the camera around. I know there's a crossbow lady coming at some point, but I don't know where. I only ever find out where once she shoots me. There you are, you bitch. Now you spunked out my... If you shoot me, I'm gonna be mad. Ah, one of these days, lady. One of these days. Out of... Come on, twice? Okay. Oh, we still got a way to go. I thought we were almost done. Wizard man. How many wizards are in this game? You're in the wrong game, Hogwarts. Good job. All right, you little gimps, get out of here. There you are. You're the one who always shoots me at the end. We're learning. Picking it up. It's a tricky shot. And we're done. We did it. That wasn't too bad. Oh, 
Oh, Wesley snaps. Sorry if I yawn, I'm getting tired. <laughs> it's late. It's been a big day. I've just been swimming for like an hour. I'm tired. We're wrapping this part up soon. Once we get the Krauser, then in the morning we'll finish it. When you get the Krauser, you're like 30 minutes out from finishing it. Okay, so we have no golden egg. Are you afraid? Are you scared? Or did you go and get it? Did you not trust me? Right in the butthole. Just the way she likes it. Welcome. All right. I've got something new. Do we that save here? Deserves. Hmm. Just in case. That See what I did there? Save to precaution. There you go. There's a legit save. So what are our legit saves? Fish monster, mine carts, here. But I feel like we're gonna go, why did we bother? Honestly. That's just in case I stuff this up. I don't think we will. So I say you could scrub that save. Pretend we didn't do it. Come on, buddy. You're a big bug. Just come and smush me. Who's running from who here? Seriously. Come here. <laughs> anyway, come here. Try and vomit on me? You're making me sick. Stop running. Don't run from me, coward. Come on, buddy, come on. Yeah, I'm gonna say, don't bother saving. Ah! Oh, <laughs> uh, I didn't push X, what the hell, man? Just because I sprinted to the edge, he took it as a jump down. Up yours. Come on, just die, man. There we go, good. Alright, yeah, no, don't save there. Don't bother saving. He was more scared of me than I was of him. Ashley, no time to lose. Alright, we got another lovely elevator ride. It might be time to, if you have a drink prepared, have a drink. I have a cup of tea, which I have sipped once. It goes without saying, this is very cold now. Alright, back to business, baby. Look at that boat, ain't she a beaut? Where do you think you're taking her? There are some knights in this area. You can kill them and get a Spinal, spinal, spindle, spinal? Good swing and a miss, buddy. So scary. You should try Ashley's armor. It works way better than yours. Hey, 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 what's up, my man? Oh, that was a good hit. Thank you for like coming point blank range for me to do that. All right, we're going to the island of Dr. Moreau. Let's see what funky experiments he has performed today.
There actually is animal people on this island. That's kind of crazy. Chapter end. Very good. Well done, everybody, for getting this far without breaking a sweat. You're amazing. We got three chapters to go. Or four. I guess you count. Chapter 13, 14, 15, and 16. Let's try and make life easy. I'm gonna try and uh, kill everybody at a distance. I'll stuff it up. I always do. There's a spotlight. You can actually shoot out a spotlight. I think, this, I think the alarm goes off no matter what. One day we'll find out. Maybe it'll be today. All right. That's a bad shot. Hey, 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 God, dick. Come on, come back, walk back. Do your path, walk back. Just stand there. Come on, Bam Bam. You see me? Fine, fine. Now I've got Molotov men and crossbows. All right, all right. Well, I wish I got a little bit further up before this all happened. So by me trying to do this better than I've ever done it before, I've actually made it worse than I've ever had it before. Hey, crossbow, come on, buddy. You Molotov down. Take a chill pill. Hey, two crossbows. Where should that wall point blank, genius? All right, pig man. He went down like a chump, my god. There you are. Alright, any more? Anybody else? Yes? Thank you for reaching out. So we're just gonna switch this turret off. And then the other one. And then that's it. Oh, look at this guy. Come on. There we go. Come on, buddy. And the head. Sucks to be you. Because you're dead. Ooh, that's a couple of molotovs. Why you got so many? I'm going to burn you twice as much. There's that spotlight. All right, grab the red herb. And we'll cruise on out of here. Hey, see, there's that spotlight. I don't think you can do it. I think there's a bigger one. Always two there are. Okay, jumps. Now you guys both transformed. What about you? Yes, no. Okay. What about your little friend that's about to appear? You transforming? Yeah, you're transforming. Back off, little guy. Back off. Guy taking a poop. Okay, I say we're like an hour out from finishing this. Isn't that exciting? Have you struggled in any sections? I want to know. If you followed this, what parts were you like, oh my god. How did you make that look easy? Why am I dying here all the time?
It felt like it'd been a while. <laughs> Try to use both guns. Um, let's get the treasure. Let's do that. We need money. We were, where are we? Always max these bad boys out. We'll get a cat statue. This one I'm confident in. Like the dog statue, not so much. This one's definitely a cat. Who could forget a cute little cat like that? Let's pick off this rocket man. Living out his days dead. And his little friend too. All right. Just two more goons up ahead and we're done with this area. Bop. Bobbity. Boop. I do a big bug. Melt away. Good boy. Alright, this next area we have a crown we can get. Pick off the guys from a distance as best as we can. And then we can finally start selling stuff. We can finally cash in. I know you've kind of been looking at me like, what the hell, man? Why are we. You could have upgraded all your guns by now. You waited so long. This is why we've waited for this. This is the point. Here we go, baby. That's some bad shooting. And I got shot as a result. That was fair punishment. Two missed shots should deserve to be crossbowed. You gonna change? I can tell you're gonna change. Mainly because you're wiggling and there's an arrow above your head telling me that you're gonna change. All right, it's a big payday here. We're gonna put our best gems and stones in this thing and then we can work out. We can work our way down. We'll go by what's most valuable and put our most valuable things with our most valuable items. And we'll make some cash, we'll max our guns out. Hell, we might even have some spare for our knife. Not that we need it, but still. Velvet Blue, I'll take you. That looks like a hurt. Oh, good dodge. Very lucky for you guys. Alright, there's nothing of interest in here. There's like flash grenades or something. Just a bunch of junk. Handgun ammo. Just things that will consume more time than they're worth it. Could save there if you want to. I don't know why you would, but I just noticed there's a typewriter there. All right, we're gonna skip this. We're gonna deal with Pigman and his little friend. Hey, 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 Chumbawamba. You really gonna transform when I find the Pigman? Okay, regenerators. Nothing to fear. I know you think, dude, you should save, you're about to fight the regenerators. You're gonna laugh. Trust me. You're gonna laugh. You're gonna be like, oh my god. This is the easiest thing I've ever done. And I've met your mum. Alright, there's one more. There you are. Speedy, speedy, speedy. Some good swings, buddy. Some good swings. Nothing in that room of interest to me. Don't care. Maybe in this box. Money. I like the money. Alright, man comes out. He's on fire. Just shoot him. That's my advice. It just seems like the nicer thing to do. He's gonna burn to death. You might as well blow him in half. She has a girl at school I knew who could do that. Welcome. All right. Something new for you. Repair. Good work if I do Sell all this. Your valuables. <laughs> Thank you. 
There is a bigger case. God damn it. Let's do this thing. I would advise you skip. You fast forward this. Unless you're interested in some gem play. We'll put this one here. Triple red. We have just enough to make this worth it. 108,000. I'll take it, man. You're the next most expensive. Watch, we only got one of these, but we got two of these. My phone is going off like crazy. Messages this time of day. Alright, what else we got? What we got? Five, six, seven thousand. Yeah, little crap green one with you. can be... may as well do all the blues, we've got quite a lot of them. Alright, we're gonna have quite a few left over. Um... Just in case we get something better later. I think there's another crown we get. So we might sell that with yellows. Okay, that should get our upgrades. What do we need? 150, 90, 120. Oh, that's pretty cheap. So this one's 150, 200,000. So not quite there for that one, but we will be by the end. I'm confident in that because we're already at 49. We just need 150,000 more. We should make some bank here. We're going to get another gun we can sell. One of these days, man, I'm gonna get you. Alright, you don't have to bother with that door, okay? So... It doesn't make time go any quicker. You're going the same distance either way. So the only thing here is these puzzles, right? So I recommend... Either memorizing them... Or taking a photo on your phone. And having it ready when you get here. So we're about to face our first regenerator. Hand cannon all the way. The uh, Chicago Sweeper is quite good at it. But the hand cannon... Just unreal. Unreal. Okay. Once on the ground, they're easy, so maybe go for their legs straight away is probably better. I wanted to see if I could get them pretty quick, but yeah, once they're on the ground, the hand cannon just blasts straight through them. You can hit multiple bugs with it. That might actually be a guess, because I actually don't think I've got the achievement for that, or the trophy. I mean, it makes sense. It, should be, it goes through people. It should be able to line up two bugs. Parasites. So we're going this way anyway. See what I mean? The gate's no different. Like, that's it. Same distance. So there's really no point in making that shortcut. So here we're going to shoot the bag, okay? Bop the bag. He'll fall out. He'll actually run past you and ignore you, but if you just gun him down, you don't have to deal with him. I highly recommend shooting out their legs now. That's definitely the way to go. I shouldn't try different things <laughs> during a playthrough like this. Especially when we haven't saved in a little bit. Alright, we'll fire this up. We've got another little password thing to get through. Which will unlock the machine gun, the submachine gun, which we can sell. And with this one done, we only have one of those left. This one's completely optional, but I figured while the thing's doing its thing, that's right, that's how good my vocabulary is, 
Uh, we may as well. We can also send that to storage, so we actually don't need that on us. We can just zip this away so we have space. Magnum ammo. Why do I always think there's a treasure in there? Some good protein right there. Alright, key cut done. Easy peasy lemon squeezy, baby. Couple of guys in here, but the main thing in here is a, is a yellow herb that we're gonna want. So we'll pick these guys up. And because our hand cannon for some reason <laughs> is a silencer, the other guy doesn't come through the door. He's on the other side waiting for us. In fact, he's admiring the regenerators. He's like, ooh, they're pretty good. Or maybe he's the guy who broke that window. And he's like, oh crap, I'm going to be in so much trouble for this. Alright, should we go for that little leggy leg? Come on, buddy, die off. Like, surely those shots should be going through multiple things. Like, because they're lying down. Come on, buddy. Say goodbye to your leg. Like, that's a pretty solid angle. Not because of the butt cheeks, just because <laughs> just unload and not miss. Die, buddy, die! Okay, there we go. We'll use this table in the middle here as, like, cover. Two bugs, one stone. Wait, did we just get the achievement while he was in the glass? That doesn't seem possible. Oh, we must have. Oh, that guy died like a chump. Thanks for the wrench. Well, there you go. The hand cannon can pull that off. It's like a pull off your leg. Nighty night. Oh, is he down? No. I thought that was another two for one. I got excited there. Okay, that's it. Regenerators. Not regenerating from that. And you were scared. Maybe you weren't. I don't know. Maybe you're braver than I am. Or just general people. Okay, let's let's uh, deal with this. Sweeper style, baby. Dynamite man, come on. There we go. That's what I like to see. Sweeper is so good at dealing with dynamite people. I think we get a second one. There he is. Look at that. <laughs> it's so quick. Come on, man. And one for luck. Beautiful. Okay, that is the regenerator -y section done. It's pretty quick. I know you're thinking during your uh, first playthrough, this felt like a long time. But that was nothing. We're another chapter down, actually. That's quite exciting. You wake Ashley up. And then we'll be on our way where... I don't know, 40 minutes out? Because we're, we're heading to Krauser's now. Ashley leaves us, spoilers. And then, yeah, Ashley. we'll save before the Krauser fight. Because judging by my clock, if Krauser's about 20 minutes out, maybe? Maybe 10? Probably a good time. Wrap it up. Cause my wife's gonna watch the man wanna watch the Mandalorian. And I wanna watch it. I'm ready, man. Surprised she hasn't come in yet. Pack that game up.
Star Wars time. Sweetheart, who I love so much. That's how she really sounds. Not like a crazy lady. You're still playing them video games? No. My wife's cool. Money, money, money. All right, 60,000. We're not close to 200,000. Would be nice. Or not. Now this, this, this. Thank you. Coolio. A deal well struck. <laughs> Don't get yourself killed now. <laughs> oh, we should buy the heavy grenade recipe at some point. We might need that. Ow. Ah, ah, ah. There's only three guys in here. Quite quick to deal with. Oh, actually, if we... Ah, uh, you know what? Never mind. I was going to say, we should buy... We, I was just talking about the heavy grenades. We need them now. So if you haven't got the heavy grenade recipe and you have no heavy grenades, now might be the time for you to grab them. But I think we'll be okay. It's just to skip... The, um, don't hit me, man. The wall. We can damage it with a couple of heavy grenades. It saves us time. You can totally fight the normal way if you want to. I mean, what section is giving you trouble? I doubt, I doubt the wrecking ball section is going to make you be like, Oh my god, I'm struggling. Ashley. No problem. Imagine if I failed there. That was a risky <laughs> move. Luckily that room is not considered a different area. Hey, 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 whoa, 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 whoa. Buddy, buddy, buddy. That's that's too many hits. Too many hits. That's some rapid fire meleeing right there, man. If I didn't have my chicken hat on, I would have died. Come along, young squire. It's a big head you got, buddy. All right, back it up, man. That's enough. That's cl that's close enough. Um, just thinking. No, we're good. We're good. I knew the spiders were coming at them. I was just thinking maybe that would be a sweeper moment, but we were fine. Ah, oh, that's right. We got this. Um, extra regenerator to deal with. These guys are actually super easy. Man, we're quite away from Krauser. I thought we were closer. I forgot about this whole waste management thing. It's a rat, dummy. Right, get ready. We go at the same time. Perfect. Um, I'm gonna hide you. It'll make my life easier. You won't block my shots. No offense. I'm sure you wouldn't. I'm not saying you would. Don't give me attitude. Just saying, just in case. Just in case. Someone's at my door. This time of night. What the fuck? I agree, Leon. What the fuck, man? It's okay, they're expected. No problem. Right, we do have to wrap up soon. <laughs> Ta-da! Perfect. Now, we'll get, um, we're getting to where we're getting to. I'm locked it in. We're getting to the start of Krauser. Then we're done. Video will end there. No, it won't, I'm kidding. Get this for me. Someone will believe that. They won't check. They'll just, they'll just take it as 
face value and be like, oh, well, I'm not going to watch the rest then. Leon could have wound it for her and then just said, hold this. See, that's a struggle there. Ornate necklace. Beautiful. Alright, so this regenerator only appears once we turn the power off. He's not here. He's sneaky guy. We'll deal with all the goons after we deal with the regenerator. Come on, big fella. Wakey, wakey. It's time for school. You need to get outside and get some sun. It's funny that the more difficult regenerators are actually easier than the normal ones. Like, he's dead. Leave her alone, you bully. All right, carry on. Shit. My estimations for how long sections take is way off. Especially when you forget sections. All right, bring up the bridge. Hopefully no one else attacks you so you don't drop me to my death. Okay. That would not be great. Fine. Though I mean really, if the bridge did fall, Leon shouldn't die. Surely he'd grab the bars Thanks. that are in the shape of a ladder and he'd hold onto them. Now right, you gotta go that way. And then just that. That's an easy one. That one you can memorize. That one you'll be fine with. All right, I am going to go Chicago sweepering this next area. Just easier when dealing with these spidery bug bastards. Okay, we are good, we are good. So here's your last chance to buy the heavy grenade recipe if you need it. We got three. We are well stocked, man. We are so well stocked. It's crazy. You would not think this is professional run. You would think I'm lying. Just in case. If I stuff up my throws or something. And I'm impatient. We'll be fine. Crown would be worth almost well, twice that much, but who cares? I can't remember where the second crown is. <laughs> or if the crown we got was the second crown. I can certainly do so. Maybe it was. <laughs> there we go. Thank you. Done. Well, Both guns maxed. Everything is a bonus now. You can buy as many first aids and stuff as you want. We're all set. I'm gonna use all three on the wall. Just to be sure, just to be doubly sure. I'm sorry, I forgot to catch you. It's all right, you landed like Iron Man, you are fine. I landed like an absolute champ. Skippy, skippy, okay. I'm sorry, we have a visitor in the room. Hang on. <laughs> Distracted. There you go. Okay, okay. Focus back. Focus back. Hey, hey. That'd have been a bad time to die because we have not saved in a long time. Bad time for someone to pop in to visit, right? Right, we're gonna wrap up. We're almost at we're almost at the point I wanna say about. And with all the distractions, everything's going fine. Everything's going great. Spider-Man's coming at us. 
Get out of here, spider boy! Is that everybody? No. Oh, <laughs> yes it is. Imagine if she didn't have the armor on, and that's how it ended. Leon, what happened to my daughter? Ah, oh, she just, I don't know, just didn't make it. No, I hope you got the son of a bitch that killed her. Oh, I got him right, sir. Tell me, who was it? Tell me who it was. Ah, oh, just some guy, just, just happened. She drove a wrecking ball, she was having a great time. She was starting to enjoy herself, she was starting to loosen up a little bit. She was getting a little bit flirty. And then, yeah, some guy, just stray bullet or something, popped around the face. Didn't see the shooter. Honestly. Don't, not sure who it was. Don't check the footage either. In fact, you know what? I sunk that entire island. You can't, you can't find out. Don't do an autopsy. Nothing. Hey, I'm trying to shoot something here, man. I'm trying to shoot something other than my shot. Going for this. I don't think I'm gonna get it. I'm not feeling it. I'm not feeling it. Ah, come on, buddy. Come on. Oh, boo. That was good. Okay, now we're just wasting time. Fine. We're done. Thanks, Ashley. Thanks. You went too busy flirting with me. Okay, so we do this. This is the um, Amber thing. Oh, maybe, maybe. No, we're close. I don't know. I want to stick it through. I was gonna say maybe we save it here. No, we're gonna keep going. So I thought that was a chapter. Okay, it's another chapter. We do keep going. <laughs> we're close. Show right around the corner. I knew it. There we go. All right. Well, that's giving away our position. Usually if you can land that guy, these guys don't know you're coming, you can just kind of pick them off. And they'll die around each other and be like, meh, I guess Bill's dead. And then do nothing about it. And now they're annoyed. Come on, buddy. Oh! Alright, there's a treasure in this tent, we'll get that. There's a first aid in the next tent, we'll get that, and then we'll save. And we'll come back and finish this because we're right at the end now like there's nothing left but the crowds of fight and that's it that's game it's crazy this like this is professional right we are super stocked for the first aids this crowds of fight i highly recommend the chicago sweeper over the hand cannon it's going to be much better for you. Especially if you've got to upgrade it like we have. And then that's it. I think we're going to save. I think we've got to wrap it up. Which I don't know why I tell you that. For all you know, I'm here this entire time. You wouldn't tell the difference. Alright, we've got a good mix. We've got lots of yellows. That maxes out. What save are we on? I don't even know. Seven! Right on the last half an hour. Here we go, baby. We're gonna fight Krauser with the Chicago Sweeper. And it's gonna make life so easy. So let's jump down. First thing we're gonna do though is hand cannon him. You can Chicago Sweep him here, but the hand cannon will just do the same thing. Bow! Next shot. Bow. Alright. Sweep it. Trust me. Sweep it. Easy. Done. It's gonna be so much quicker, so much easier. The final fight where he's transformed, it'll be a piece of cake. You may get hit a couple times. You might play sloppy. I'm feeling a bit sloppy-ish this morning. Let's see how we go. Holding this. And we're done. That's the area that we'll end up in. So does it mean like, <laughs> When we're traveling through the caves, he's quickly setting up bear traps and stuff and lasers. He's like, I got uh, Leon's coming, I ain't got time. Though you're always prepared, man. Alright, we're gonna shoot this. Bop it. 
Then the next one, he's gonna jump down us. So if you jump down here and turn around, he's gonna rush us. So you just turn around and shoot. And he'll throw a flash grenade instead of tackling you and hurting you. It's a nice easy dodge. All right, hide behind this wall. Just wait and you're okay. Watch out for bear traps. I'm gonna shoot this laser. We shoot this gun. And we shoot that laser. Watch out for this gun. And this bear trap. Easy. So predictable. This one is so predictable. Bear trap. And machine gun. Now, as we go down here, don't keep running too far. Slow it down. Wait. And then go. Otherwise, they'll hit you. You don't want to get hit. The only section we're going to really suck at, because I'm impatient, will be the section we were admiring that's going to have bear traps and stuff. Stick to the left side, and you'll miss. And then we're up here. I don't know why. I'll probably get bopped here. Just because I'm impatient, I'll try and make a gap. Alright, I reckon we can make it. Well, I don't, I'm not going to learn my lesson, am I? No. Never will. Never will. Alright, I want to shoot at him. Why not? We got, we got the help. We're going to be fine. Stop shooting at me! Nah. I swear sometimes you might get lucky and hit his arrow and it blows up on him. Am I gonna get hit again? No, we're okay. Okay, that's it. That's it. We're done. And you are. I, I always rush it. Okay, this area, we're gonna tank some shots here, okay? We're just gonna tank him. We're just gonna be beast mode. We got heals. Just gun him down. No, he did, barely did a scratch to us. It's not a lot of health. Evade. You can use that to knock him. And then just cut him down. I brought you up a little bit closer than I would like. Evade. Hey, 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 hey. <laughs> okay, I think he was ready to leave. And we just happened to block him by accident. I'm sorry, man. I'm sorry. Yeah, leave, leave. He just got caught on me and he got pissed off. So many heals. Okay, this first attack, I don't know, is he supposed to flash him or shoot him? I'm just gonna run. It's a bit of damage. I don't know, I don't, there's gotta be a way. He always gets me, so I've just given up. I'm <laughs> trying to avoid it. Congratulations on your newfound faith. Grab a herb, that fixes your damage anyway. And then we just jump this and we roll. Ta-da! Easy. We caught one hit. So what? Uh, big wolf. Maybe you're supposed to bait him out and then turn and run backwards. I really don't know. He's always hit me. I've tried to duck it. I guess I haven't tried to flashbang him. I'm going to try that now. Yes, I'm experimenting again. Roll. I'm going to climb up top. And deal with him up there. Yeah, definitely. Put some flashing in doesn't do shit. Chicago Sweeper, baby. That's what we're gonna use. Aim for his legs. Ah, oh, crap, I mean, <laughs> I got caught in the fat end. Oh, well, let's just see what we could do. So really, you just get through this by shooting him in the legs. It will stun him, you gut him down, and then you jump off the edge to avoid getting hit. But whatever, let's just tank it. Die, 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 die. Such an angry little man. How good, how good is that? Seriously, Chicago Sweeper. If you're using the hand cannon, it's much more difficult to hit him in the legs and stuff. Where well, that's just easy. Okay, we're heading to the end. Oh no, we got a little, we got a little islandish section coming up. I forgot. We're close to the end. 
15 minutes, let's say that. I'll take the money. We don't really need it, but I'll take it. We Actually, we don't really need to pick up anything anymore. Our guns are maxed, we've got healing for days. You could just speed through this whole thing now. I have some new welcome. What do you got, chump? Got some rare thing that's good work if I do say so myself. All of this is yours, Simba. Ruby's all thank you. This is gonna be a great save. Like can. new game plus Wild save. Choice. Gonna have your guns maxed. Gonna have so many healing things. Like that's it's gonna be the one to just muck around in. I don't think we're gonna max that out though. We might get close. Oh, we gotta buy a rocket launcher as well. At the end, we're not gonna fight the boss normally. We could, we totally could, 100. But I can't be bothered. Why? Why bother? We buy a rocket launcher, and then we're done. So I'm gonna have to play through this again, get the infinite rocket launcher, make that a save file, so then you've literally got a save file that has infinite hand cannon, infinite Chicago sweeper, infinite rocket launcher. That would be the best muck around playthrough. That sounds good to me. That sounds great. I'm definitely gonna do it. I guess I'm gonna play professional again. Although I don't have to play professional, do I? Because in New Game Plus you pick your difficulty. One combat chopper compliments the Hunnigan. Call them back. And I'd show these assholes what we got. Guess it'd be a good, uh, I guess, I was going to say it's a good speedrun thing, but then I don't think speedrunners count starting with end game stuff. Speedrunning. And again, who cares? Do not walk, man. I like to stay at this ladder. Because then I know where they're coming from. They can't sneak up on me, they can't hit me. Yeah, the helicopter's flying around doing stuff. Hey, hey, hey. Can't. Maybe he's not flying around doing stuff. Yeah, you're slacking off, man. The hell hit me there? You little bastard. Oh, there you are. <laughs> what a jerk, man. I didn't even see him. Okay, everybody's dead here, man. You gotta blow those doors or what? I'm waiting on you, man. You're holding me up. Ooh, red herb. Not bad. That's a good get. Money, money, money. That's it? You kill like four people, five people? Big crap, man. Come on, buddy. Good job. I was being very patient there. Alright, you always transform. First aid spray. We'll be taking that. Go with our collection. Alright, this area we need heavy grenades. We bought the heavy grenade recipe just in case we don't have any. Because we haven't been picking up red items. There's a high chance we might be low on stock. We have one, we need two. Okay, we do need to craft one. Hopefully we have a large... Yeah, that's the only thing we have, cool. Worked out well for me. All right, that's that dealt with. Let's see how quickly we can get through this. I'm keeping them up there for you. Nice! That time. They better be dead.
Okay, I think if you rush the door, it causes him to blow it up quicker. But I'm not sure if that also makes him run out of ammo. Because as soon as that door's open, he goes, I'm out of ammo. So that means I gotta deal with all these guys myself. Still helping? Nope, he's done. Okay. That might actually, trying to speed it up may actually make this slower. Now we have to kill everybody. Yeah, because they keep coming. They chop people with axes, man. What year is this? Jeez, man, you're jumping in front of me! Whoa, you had dynamite! Oh, that would have been a terrible way to go. Okay, so maybe keeping the helicopter around for a little bit longer is actually better. So going slower may be better. Because i got to stop the machine gunners, but I can't focus on them because these guys just keep coming. Come on, jump. I hear somebody grunting, but I don't know where from. Just in case he's not dead. Alright, let's boogie. Looks like he's transforming. Grab this. We'll head up top. Get rid of this guy. Never seen him there before. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Let me start coming up the ladders. Go away. Okay. What the hell, man? What the hell? Okay. Let's get this button done. We'll get a uh, bull man jumping down as a result. Oop, we want to deal with him first. Hey, buddy. Oh, one hit, one kill. That was unexpected. I wonder why he died in one hit. Oh, dynamite, man. That better have killed that spider. Called BS if that spider kept kicking after that. Not dynamite, man. I hope you just killed yourself. All right, one more lever and we are out of here. We got spiders coming around. Don't shot me. Whoa, 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 whoa. Settle down, fellas. Settle down. Where are you guys hiding at? Jex. Stay down. Okay, I think that's enough people. Got a few extra people that time. There's still people. And on the machine gun, really? Up yours. I'm getting out of here. Screw you, spider. Get out of my way. What if he'll follow me? Nah. Hey, there's a typewriter there. You can save there if you want. You got plenty of saves. If you've saved as many times as I have, you got heaps of saves.
deal with all these buggies. The last thing you want is to die, especially when you've got this many heals. To be killed by a bug, and then it's like, why did he die? He had so many heals, he should have been fine. All right, this room, you gotta do what I say, okay? If you don't do what I say, you're gonna have a bad time. I'm gonna duck under this. Once you're in here, you're locked in here. You don't wanna wake up these bags, so we're gonna crouch and not touch these bags. So you see this bag that wiggles? Don't touch that bag. These other bags are okay. I swear to God, if that snake bites me on this run out of here, I will not be happy. All right. The only other bag we're gonna not touch is the one next to these boxes. So we're gonna shoot these boxes. So that's our running path. So we're gonna hold this. It'll open that door there. So the path that we cleared is where we're gonna go. Try not to hit the bag, but if you do, hopefully you make it out of this room. It's gonna look like you failed, because it's really low, but he makes it. I've got some new art. Well, what do you got for me, man? What you got? Good is new. Got some goods for you, buddy. I think we're good, man. I think we're good. All right, we're just gonna get through this area. Watch out for this bug. Almost there. I reckon I can hit that guy. One down. Ha ha ha! All right, some bugs will just appear as soon as you get here. Unavoidable. You can't sneak, you can't stealth. They're just gonna appear. They're just gonna come for you. Come on! Wasting my time. Stupid bug. Alright, can we get this guy in time? Ah, oh, yeah, yeah, you stupid bug. Wasting my time, man. Stuff me up! No. I'm not gonna cop a rocket to the face. Deal with pig boy. Where you at, piggy? Come on. Your friend died in one here, by the way. How defiant of you. Eat it, rocket boy. Nice. All right, don't forget to pick up your goodies. There's a yellow herb in here. And our pig gem. There you are. You know what, I haven't used the grenade. Present for you. All right, Chicago sweep of this, because it's gonna be so much easier. Like this section, not just that mine. It's because they got shields and it's just, it's just gonna be quicker. Down you go, Champaroonies! <laughs> oh, don't hold dynamite. Dumb thing to do. And then that is... Everybody. Coolio. We got our sweeper out, we're gonna use it again. To blow up this. That guy moved, I swear. 
All right, we got a pig and some goons coming. Who to get first? I guess pig man. And there's a guy in here with him. Hey, hey, hey. Thought you were coming swinging at me, man. This guy sometimes transforms, but not if he's blown in half. All right, here they come. These guys have spiders fall out of them. So just spamming the sweeper is going to make it easier. We'll grab all that stuff on the way out, don't worry. Some bugs will come. You could lit you could just run. But because I'm grabbing this stuff. It might hold me back. No, I probably could have run. Yeah, I could have kept going. Alright, if I get hit here, it's my own fault. We're being too slow. No, they sound close. They sound close. Back up, back up. Back off. <laughs> go away, go away, go away, go away. Oh, get stuck. Where the hell did you come from, man? Yeah, alright, just run. Next time, just run. Don't fight them. Oh, if you want to. But focus them. Alright, we are at the end. I'm going to have to save again. I don't want to save, okay? I'm telling you now, I don't want to save. You can make it clean to the end here without this extra save. Well, my mommy's here. Laboratory. So we're gonna stop. Looks like it's this way. We're gonna stop when I get to the end of this chapter. She can wait. She's fine. You wouldn't think it would be difficult to get like four hours to yourself, would you? That's all I want. It's just a clean window of four hours. Just to, <laughs> just to play a game. It's my job. And I can't even get that. Then we have like ten minutes left. We're done. Like we're at the end. We literally go and fight the final boss now and one hit kill him with a rocket launcher. Oh, hey, you can skip this one. Okay, so close now. Pro tip, push forward. Probably a good time to save anyway. If I was gonna save, I'd probably save right before the boss or um, the jet ski section. But I, that's that's my recommendation for you, just in case you miss your rocket launcher shot, then you have to fight him normally, or if you suck at the jet ski. I personally wouldn't save again, because be from here on out, it's. Pretty easy, pretty straightforward. But again, if we've, you've got the saves, you've got heaps of saves, so you've got no reason to risk it, really. Now, save number eight. Right on, here we go. End game, baby, chapter 16. I feel like five saves were legit in this. Maybe. If I had a clean four hour, four and a half hours, I think we could have avoided several of these saves this, for this game. But, I mean, hell, eight saves or whatever it is, that's not a lot. That's pretty good. You've got 50% of what you really need in the end. So, plenty of places to choose where you want to save if you find something difficult. But, there you go. This is pretty much professional done 
easy. Like, I can't see this getting any easier than this. I don't know what else you could add to this run to make this easier. Yeah, you could say door skips, but like I said earlier, we're not doing door skips, glitching through walls and stuff, because there's no guarantee that's going to be there in the future. So to make a guide based around that would just be a disservice to anyone later in life following it. So everything done here is legit. Everything done here is exactly what you can do and what they expect you to do. So I don't know. I don't think there's an easier way to get professional S plus ranking. Chicken hat, infinite guns, exclusive tickets. Like what more? What can they add? <laughs> Maybe they you can play as Krauser. That guy's nuts. He'll breeze through this game. Okay, we need to make some money here. We need to do some little inventorying. What do we got? No big things to add gems to, so let's sell up then. We need 160,000. We're pretty close already, surprisingly. 123. We don't need these. Not bad. I guess we don't need any of these grenades. Thank you. 15,000 to go. No, oh, five. Wait, yeah, 15. So we sell. A deal well struck. Yeah, two more of these. Mats, baby. Mats. That's it. All right, we're buying the rocket launcher. It says we have no space, but we should have heaps of space. It's probably just dis disorganized. Still so many heals. So even if we miss this shot, it's possible. Uh, we'll just keep going anyway. We've got infinite ammo. I'm sure we can take the boss if we fail. But hopefully we don't miss the shot. Hopefully we just nail this right on out of here and clock in at like four hours and something. That gives you plenty of time for anything else you wanted to do, for mucking around with anything else. So, a good run. I'm happy with this. This has been a good day, man. Extra herb and some spice. So if he stepped to the side and that went, that went through him and missed, that would have been embarrassing. All right, chicken man. Here we go. Finally, look that suits you, Sadler. A monster in and out. Still, I need to cut his date short. It's not me. Come on, Ada. I find the sweeper is quicker than the hand cannon. Yeah, much quicker. The hand cannon, we would have had to dodge a couple of slams. And then even another sweep. So, sweeper for that section. We are done! Chicken man lives to fight another day. If you are worried about this jet ski section, you can save here. You have the saves. You have so many saves left in the tank. You could save there seven times and still be okay. We're not out of here yet. Just start mashing X already. And you just jump straight over. Alright, normally I sidestep this guy, but I feel like shooting him for once. Come on, buddy. No one else is able to run around. What so, makes you so special? Shift this out the way. Alright, jet ski time. If you crash into a wall, you're dead. Simple as that. So go quick! And then as you make this turn, slow it down, line it up, go through. Alright, next turn, slow right down, and then cruise on through. You can't make that turn at full speed, okay? You will hit the wall, you will explode, and you will die. And then it's going back to your previous save, which is hopefully not too far away if you did save just before this section. 
and crash into any of those containers, you will die. Little things like that you buff on, they don't do any damage. Alright, big jump. Whee! Let's go to the left. Cruise on through. This part may be a little intimidating because the view becomes really restrictive. It can feel like you're going to slam into a wall because you can't see much. Just trust you've got the skill. Head to the right of this. It looks like you can go left, but head right, left, and then head right. And you're free, baby. That's it. Just sit in the middle. Head for daylight. You're done. You beat professional. You got an S+. Plus. Let's check our time. Four hours, right? Four hours something. Four hours and three minutes, eight saves. Best. Like I said, you could probably remove a few of those saves. I reckon five overall were necessary if you were sitting in one playthrough, maybe less, but that's it. That's the whole game. Man, that was fun. I had a good time. I hope you enjoyed this and I hope to see you in future videos.